Welcome to the Black Phillip Show with Patrice O'Neill. Women's power is in your fear of whatever they're going to do. Black Phillip. Fat-tongued mongoloid. Doctor. I told my girl she's the fourth most important thing in my life. So sensitive. It was me, my career, my Family. mother, and then her. Ooh, that silk. She only thinks she knows shit because I tell her shit. Oh, wow. Keeping your pen pad strong. I think my girl in my life is worth five bitches now. Bitch better have my money. women. Do you understand what I'm saying to you, Danny? Yeah. Do you understand, Drew? I see. Do you understand, Liam? I understand. Reggie. Yo. Do you understand? Yeah. What are you, you turning shit down? What do we do, Jack? Understand. Yeah. So, who made the turn down decision? You guys have to see how this song lights up Patrice's face. <laughs> He's bopping. <laughs> this is his joint. <laughs> Man. It's Bitch Better Have My Money by AMG. I'm saying that because on Pal Talk, when you go to Pal Talk, they'll play a song and no one ever knows what the fuck is playing. They'll just play it. Bitch Better Have My Money by AMG. Just go online. You'll find it. It's on iTunes. He's an Ice Cube wannabe, but it's still a damn good song. I don't think he's Ice Cube wannabe. No? I think he's just a regular guy. That, that was his style back then. Uh-huh. Yeah, true. That was how they was rocking. Easy E. Pussy ain't nothing but a game to me. <laughs> when a hoe want to fuck with a bro of a teenage pimp. I want to see that grip. So, everybody. Bitch better have my money. If you sitting there with your girlfriend, everybody. Bitch better have my money. Look at your girl and put your finger on her temple like, like a finger gun. Point and touch her head. And then push it and say that to her. <laughs> She's always saying to you, nigga better have my money. Nigga, when you gonna take me out? When you gonna take me to the movie? My birthday. Our anniversary. My mother's birthday. Fuck all the rigmarole. Did you hear that, nigga? You think rappers ain't smart? He just said rigmarole. <laughs> and Ronda with ho. You better sing along, ho, with a rigmarole. Fuck all the rigmarole. Bitch better sing along, ho. Fuck all the shenanigans. Bitch better, um... <laughs> Fuck all the, um... <laughs> Fuck all the shenanigans, cause we gon' bang again. We gon' bang again. Nigga, fuck all the shenanigans, cause we gonna bang again. I'm hungry, give me a sandwich. Bitch! <laughs> Bitch! You know, I never heard that song till you played it. Nigga, See, I don't understand I why shit. that shit is not famous, it. son. It's It should be an anthem. Men should have an anthem. Bitch better have my money. And he hit out it's the smoothness of how... <laughs> and, he, and he starts... This is, what, this is very planned out. Here's how he starts it. He starts it without music. That's the first thing you hear is, Bitch better have my money. Is that, does that, is that explain? He doesn't need to even have a song. He didn't even have to write music after he says, Bitch better have my money. You can do that with anything. Bitch better bend down and lick my left ball. Just uh, announce what the fuck is going to happen. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But, you know, listen... Oh, that makes me happy, that song. And I'm feeling good because I took a hiatus for a lot of reasons. One, because they had us in that little studio. That shit was, couldn't happen. Two, two, it's because I traded in my pimp card for a second. I traded it in. I traded it in. I decided 
Oh, man, I'm getting tired. Don't have 10, 15 bitches, so I can't relate to a nigga that has 10, 15 bitches right now. So I was I was actually living on fumes of old pimpness. <laughs> and what happened? <laughs> old slave pimpness. And what happened is, for some reason, I just wrote it out. And here's the thing. When you're Mojo, you, you've seen the, the, the what's the movie? Uh, that Austin, uses Austin Powers. Austin Powers. When your mojo is gone, you don't force it to come back. You understand what I'm saying? You don't force your mojo to come back. You got to kind of sit there and ride out the... Marinate. Uh, I would have to say you have to ride out the... The lows. The low. And I had to ride out a low. And it ain't like I love my bitch any more or any less. It was just the fact is... I didn't have 50 bitches like I used to. I used to have 50. No safety net. And it's easy. It's really easy. Pimping is easy when you don't give a fuck about the bitch. You don't. It, it's it's so easy when you got 10, 15 girls that you can care less about. It's much easier to pimp than if you got one bitch that you care about. Pimping that hoe is hard. It's like the army. It's like a general. It's harder to pimp a, a captain. Whoever the, is under. What's under a general? Like, what's the what's the rank? Is, you know that shit? Lieutenant. Lu- I don't think lieutenants is like right under a general. Colonel? No, that's top. Captain? Is a general? Well, I don't know. But the guy underneath the ge- the general. The, whoever the guy is <laughs> underneath the general, it's it's harder to like get him when he says yes sir, no sir. It's just formalities, because you, you kind of call him Tim. You don't say lieutenant. You kind of go, hey Tim, look, you got to take care of this other shit. And he goes, yes, yes Frank. You know, it's like formality. So my bitch right now is so high up on the on the list of ranking, it's really, I can't pretend that I'm, like, she's not a hoe no more. But she is a hoe. She's a hoe in terms of, like, some some bitches are hoes two ways. They a hoe because they sit down to pee. Now, my girl's a hoe now just because she sits down to piss. And any bitch, anybody that sits down to piss is a hoe. So when I say, what up, hoe, you know what I mean? I'm really saying because you sit down to pee. But before I used to go, what up, hoe, and then, hey, hoe. Go do this, cause she used to just be the chick that's a hoe. Now she's my girl, and she's still a hoe, cause she sit down to pee, or she bleed for no reason every month. <laughs> Her vagina looks like a crime scene every month for no reason. And then the scramble eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, that's oatmeal. Nigga like said it's just a mess. Trying to look like oatmeal with a string hanging out. <laughs> so that's why she's a hoe but it took a minute because i'm trying to get it back it's hard because they're relentless you know you know that so anyway um so i apologize that i haven't been here for a while uh we haven't been here for a while drew uh dante leah who is the lovely new lady because if y'all remember Kara Foster worked for fucking Don Imus now. <laughs> that bitch went and got successful. She got upgraded. She got upgraded. I used to abuse her, but it was like black on black crime. Now she's like fucking over there with Don <laughs> Imus. Now her head gonna get big. Well, not really. Nah, it's already she huge. is she is the official apology for nappy headed hoe. Uh, <laughs> he had to go buy his own. He went and got his own nappy headed hoe. <laughs> <laughs> And we got a straight-headed hoe here. <laughs> and Leah. What's your last name again, Leah? Bonima. Lena bon- Leah Bonima. She's a, she's, a, she's a really good girl, man. She's our, um, she'll probably be gone next week. <laughs> but she's here for now. She's a nice girl. Leah's sexy. You're going to get a job with Cousin Brucey. Leah's a, Leah's a, <laughs> <laughs> Leah's a soldier. And she goes out with a comic. So that's unfortunate because we can't really talk to her like we want to because her, her a good friend of us. Yeah, not really. I'm not yeah. a good friend. Right, of fucking well, a good friend of mine. <laughs> but you know, you, you know him and shit, and, and <laughs> you, you kind of respect him. But Leah's like, she's like a, she, you know, she's trying to trying to uh, she's trying to be the exception to the rule. She's a she's other woman pretty. Like she's mistress pretty. <laughs> 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 she ain't number one bitch pretty, but she's pretty. She's pretty. She's like, yeah, I do that. Yeah. She's yeah, a if she's pretty. a soldier, she can find a place. Yeah. 
But I would cheat on Leah. I always look at a chick and wonder how long it takes me for to cheat on her. I would cheat on Leah right away. Wow. <laughs> While I'm fucking her, I'll be thinking about how I'm going to cheat on this bitch tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Leah, babe, but Leah, she uh-huh. has that. She's it's something about her. She's a sexy girl. She has she's a white girl, but she has a mix to her. Put it this way, niggas would fuck the shit out of Leah. Like she gets mad black dudes. She one of them white girls, and she's not. Here's a here's a misconception: black dudes love fat white women. We don't love fat white women. Like, like I, there's some niggas that are ridiculous. They'll fuck anything white. There's some niggas that be like, she white. Oh, I got to just uh, fuck her because she's white. Prize. She's like, <laughs> if you walked around the way with her, you wouldn't get niggas. Wouldn't like, niggas like, all right, yo, all right, cool. Like, she's she has black approved body. Hips like, you know, if a black girl was shaped like her. She niggas, you know what I'm saying? And she got like a <laughs> a real ethnic look. She's not like a regular white girl, but she's racist. That's the funny thing. <laughs> <laughs> She's a racist white girl who should like black dudes, but she don't. <laughs> so it's really cool. I'm glad, you know. Anyway, so I, we introduce you to Leah first, Leah Bonham, and we appreciate you coming. And, uh, of course, Drew Boogie. Of course. Coming here, just chilling. Uh, and uh, a young man over here who's, uh, whose pimp card, by the way, has been renewed. <laughs> you tell. Renewed. For, matter of fact. It was a try, like BJ's wholesale. You know how you <laughs> you renew once a year. They gave this nigga a five year renewal, ah, like a new truck. You know how you don't have to get a you don't have to get a, a, a lot of work. A lot of when work, you buy a new yeah. truck, you don't have to get the inspection sticker till like 2012. <laughs> that nigga got new truck pimping right now. Ah. No bullshit. Me. Motherfucker. Oh my god. Happy birthday to me, nigga. I, I didn't get new truck pimping, but what I did was get like, I got a, um. Yeah, like tenure. Cause my head gaskets went for a minute on my engine. You got, you got new plates and they gave you the 10 day pass. Yes. <laughs> They're gonna see if I'm back to my old self. But after last night, nigga, I nice. am back. Nice. I'm no bullshit. Now don't get me wrong, people out here listening. I'm not like y'all. It, it was a context. I'm not. A, I'm just sitting there going. My context is, man. I'm tired of this one bitch. I'm tired of looking at her. I'm tired of talking to her. She makes me sick. And I wasn't really getting out there heavy getting other bitches because I I don't lazy. I'm, I'm not a big like cheating on a shit because she's a, the bitch down from do threesomes. Why would I do that? It's like it's 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 disloyal to cheat on a bitch that will that goes against the rules. Too. Yeah, that is the you understand what I'm saying? threesome rule. And let's not forget, we, let's introduce myself and Patrice O'Neill, Black Phillip. And if you, this is your first time listening, because you know you got somebody out there that say, "Oh, you gotta listen to the show and and what it's about." What it's about, first of all, for any women who are listening for the first time, it's about trying to let you understand why we hate you. <laughs> <laughs> that's the first. That's the first like trickle down thing is when we say we hate you it's not about having you murdered it's not about having you you know i want to throw you in a river like these white boys be doing their wives and all that shit we want to get rid of you the, the, the hatred is what i'm talking about is before that happens before a nigga puts an anchor around your neck and throws you in the water before he kills you you don't the police know you killed her but can't find the body and they still charge you and you still go to jail, but you've hit the body real good. That type of shit. It's not, a, it's about not like this little dumb motherfucker that went through the mall and shot everybody and his dumb. It's, it's before you get to that level of this is how I'm going to be a star. And basically guys want to be a star just to get pussy. <clears throat> you know, half the thing is to be a celebrity. What a celebrity is, don't get me wrong. It's to make us match what a vagina is coming in. Like, my status, my status as a human being, as a man, is only here so we have an even level of meeting place for the pussy. Like, the pussy's like, you're a celebrity if you have a pussy. You ever see women walk around the street with sunglasses on because they don't, like, they don't want to be recognized? Or a beautiful woman that dresses down, she has a hat on and, and her hair pants. up, sweatpants, trying to look stank and trying, and, and trying to be in her own world with her headphones. And it just be some regular bitch you've never seen before? And you be like, bitch, why are you acting like you Lindsay Lohan, bitch? That's because she's just trying to go, please, 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 no autographs. 
Because that's what that mentality is. So what men have to do is we have to buy a new truck. We have to keep our credit above 700. <laughs> we have to buy. You see the sexy coats me and Dante have? You think I need a sexy coat with sparkles on it, nigga? <laughs> you think I need a sexy coat? I'd wear a paper coat, nigga, if I could. <laughs> if it wasn't for what? Pussy! Trying to get a bitch to look at the sparkles and then go, okay, yeah, I'm this, I'm that, I'm Patrice O'Neill. Yeah, you see me on VH1 last year. Remember me? It's just to get her to stop in the street and say hello. You understand what I'm saying to you? This is why, let me explain something to you fucking lames who, who, these two girls, one cup fucking pussies who are throwing up everywhere, you fucking (laughs) faggots. (laughs) Faggots! Do you understand how disgusting? I'm not happy with it. There's a whole crew of people throwing up because throwing up. they watching two beautiful women take a shit on each other and then give us the service of throwing up on each other. Do you know why that's sexy? It's not because I like shit. It's because I hate women. <laughs> That's what that shit is. It's hatred. You know what the hatred is? Last night I had a threesome of mm. all time. Yeah. Nigga. Trooper. My threesome would have killed Muhammad Ali last night. <laughs> <laughs> That's no what of shaking. all time. He would have saw that threesome and I would have said, this shit's the best of all time. <laughs> and he would have stopped shaking and was like, no, I'm the greatest of all time. No, nigga. Look at this shit I'm doing tonight. <laughs> I found a soldier. Me and her and my girl. This my, Me, my girl, and this bitch could compete for the threesome. If, if they had a threesome contest, <laughs> best threesome, I'm t- I'm telling you, last yeah. night we would have went up against Mary Love and no, Mary Jada Love Fire. and Jay oh, Fire versus is- me and this other bitch and my girl. <laughs> is this the girlfriend for your relationship now? Nigga. Nah. No. Nigga, it might be. Whoa! Not, this fucking bitch like something happened. Whoa. Was a soldier. After it, at the end, we told the bitch go sleep in the other room in her cubby hole. She got in her <laughs> cubby hole. I have two bedrooms. Get in. Went to sleep like a baby. Oh shit. Woke up. Here's what a soldier she is. No bitch goes to sleep over a house she never been over. This bitch slept like a baby. <laughs> got up refresh hello good morning <laughs> my girl was acting like a little faggot you know because she gets nervous about losing her spot but i gotta try to tell her about that shit this bitch look man and don't let me get off subject because uh, but we're gonna get back to that but the, the i had to tell her about why we hate men or why men hate women it's because what we have to do all the shit i named that we do like you're djing you get pussy because you're DJing, but that is a skill level that you have acquired over work. the years. It took work to get that it. That shit is, 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 is valuable mm-hmm. to, to many people. Pussy's only valuable to whoever's fucking it at the time. One at a time, pussy's valuable. Unless she's a porn star, Which and is. then it's valuable to a lot of people. Right. But you have to be a whole other type of bitch. Right. But just a regular girl walking through the streets, your pussy's, it's not worth anything except for who's fucking it. So the reason we hate you, and the reason why two two girls, w- one cup is such a phenomenon. And if anybody didn't see that, or or hear about it, it's just these these. I'm sure you did, but these these two girls, um, I assume they're from Brazil, is what they said. Mm-hmm. Are they? Okay. <clears throat> one is um, I'll describe them, because a lot of people couldn't even describe them because they were sitting there what, looking going, at the shit. Yeah, oh my good. gosh, he's shitting on another person. They was hot as shit, and they throwing up. She stuck her hand down her and, throat. And didn't even convulse. Out. She, she didn't just, even convulse. She just... Uh, uh, and just on another no, bitch. No, no convulsiveness. I stood up. Like, bravo. Bravo. Here, here. here. <laughs> Aren't you glad these are... Uh, these are the, is there a cup? <laughs> you oh. got a clink, 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 clink. <laughs> I like to uh, say a toast to these bitches who eat shit. <laughs> and everybody's on the internet like, oh, God. Now, the thing that, I, first first thing I, I said to myself when I heard about it was, all right, man, look, uh, man, who cares? I've seen it before. But the way this thing became such a phenomenon, yeah, because I thought to, my, to myself, it had to be just ridiculous because I've seen some horrid yeah. shit videos. Like, I've seen one that I still think beats that is, the, is an Asian girl in the bathtub 
she cocks her legs back to where her knees are by her ears and shits in her own face. Tub girl. <laughs> oh, tub girl, yes. That's a classic. Yeah. What that is? Yeah. <laughs> that is fucking, that's Hall of Fame horror. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but she wasn't drinking it. Who gives a fuck? She shit diarrhea in her <laughs> own face, <laughs> nigga. He's splitting hairs. Are you, okay, yeah. okay, okay. <laughs> This is, is this that's it, right? right? Is that what you're talking about? I'm, I this didn't see. Is, it. Oh wait, shit! Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, that's uh, ad, hold on. God damn it! Hold on a second. This is Tub Girl. Oh. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> son. Yeah. Son. <laughs> Tub Girl. That's, oh, wow. That's almost like that's the Exorcist. <laughs> you get that bitch shit in lava in her whole face. face. Ass lava. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes. So yeah. anyway, all right, everybody's like, two girls, one cup. Did you see it? I'm like, all right, man. Now, look, let me if have... you're not talking about tub girl like this, <laughs> then this shit you... must be horrid. So I, I click it on. It, it was hard to find, too. It, the, now, it, the momentum you, was... Oh, you... Wait a minute, hold on. The, the momentum, keep your thought. The momentum, of course, is building up because I can't just type two girls, one cup. It started to be like some sinister... Mm. Like I can't find it, shit, and I'm getting more and more, like anxious. Holy shit, man! How do I find this? This is this is getting me fucked up. <laughs> what was, what was I was gonna say, how many <clears throat> times did you when you called me? That was when you first looked at it, or no? Yeah, I looked at it because I refused to look at it for a second. Then I said, all right, two girls, one cup. I was I typed in T W O girls one W O O N E. The first time I saw it when you when you called me. Did you see it, Leah? I saw some of it, and then I didn't. You couldn't deal with it at the Too much shitting going on. I just was like, mm. look at this. She's and she's trying to be have this cool like mm, I wasn't into it. You just, you probably went, oh god, no, shitting. Now you see the chicks. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Leah's watching it now. Let me. Uh, see. Of course, Danny has it right. Wait, turn turn uh, it this way a minute, Danny. Can you, you put it up there? Oh, uh, see that? Yeah, I can't. Hang on, hang on. Yeah. Look, I just like, that, what are they eating? Have they... Rewind that for a second. Let me let me explain. That was hot yeah, right there. Yeah. This is this this two girls one cup thing, and you probably talk about it all goddamn day. Mm -hmm. But um, this two girls one cup thing, dude. Um, fuck it, Danny. Fuck it. You gonna fuck it? We don't need to see it in, in on forty two inch plasma. Oh, <laughs> <clears throat> you gotta understand. Um, where was I? Oh. So so I go and it's, it was hard to find. Like you couldn't just find it. Everything for Two Girls One Cup was all people reacting to Two Girls One Cup. Now it, that's what it turned into. Yeah. So I get to it and okay, it starts out with two pretty decent looking girls. Rewind it to the beginning for a second. And this is the thing on YouTube, no one is explaining. The two girls, one cup. No one's telling you what it is. Now, it starts off with smoking. two. Now, stop there for a second. Now, now right there. This is. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> now, you got to understand me and, and, and Dante, uh, and as far as porn goes, we're quite advanced. <laughs> we're quite advanced. Like, me and him have these real discussions about who the best person is. Who's this, Like, there's this, this porn star named Pinky. <laughs> Who yeah. we had a conversation Black about, and, and it's very Black dudes is philosophical. Exactly. Pinky is a bad bitch. She's about four foot two, but she's, she's not almost, a midget. Almost a midget. She's almost a midget, but she's like a monster. She's a monster, and she is a she's a she's into what she's doing. Okay, um, so we talked about her one day, and it was weird. At the end, I was like, we, did we just have this real <laughs> CNN kind of discussion about this funky bitch, right? <laughs> <laughs> and we did. So this thing here, I called him afterwards. After I watched it a couple of times, I said, ah, what is it, it? Why, why is this what is it? fucking with people? Now, first thing I did was, you got to understand, ladies. And I'm saying ladies. Because I, I just, I, I disregard any guy that goes, yucky, mm. to any, anything sexual. Bitch getting her eyes poked out by, by a uh, cock, a mutant turkey. <laughs> Shouldn't. <laughs> no guy should go, oh, God, no. We should just go, oh, that's fucked up. Bitch got her eyes poked out by a turkey. <laughs> that's evil. But we sh no guy should ever go, oh, God, no, Jesus. It just, it just, I, I, I just disregard you when you go, oh, God. Oh, oh. So <clears throat> it starts off with these two. One is a bronze. Gorgeous. Beauty. Straight dime. We want to, again, uh, uh, Danny. <clears throat> again, did I introduce my friend Danny here? 
No, you didn't. Say Danny no. was there. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. My, my fucking my man Danny, of course, man. He's part of the show. God bless him. We couldn't do it without him. Um, <clears throat> play it, play it, Danny. All right, stop right there. Just stop it there. Smoking. These two girls. If you seen these two girls walking up the street, one is like kind of like this sandy blonde Spanish mix. Leah kind of got a face like her. Leah got that face, that face where she could be white, but she's not white. She's like, you got that face. You do. Like a, like a, Leah's looking like, I got a shitty girl face. No. <laughs> I know you're looking at them like they ain't shit, but let, let's, let's just be honest here. She, they're both pretty. Would you say so right now before this shit happens? Yes. They're both love. And one got so a tattoo on her neck. Mm. She's a soldier. And they both got no, this one got her blouse on with no pants on underneath. Mm. Like, so it's like an office girl thing. So they, they don't get into it. It just starts right away with one sucking the other one's tit. Mm. And then it's like an office vibe kind of thing going on. Like, And there's, there, there's definitely an ethic in that. Like, they into each other. They into each other. That's what's hot. They're definitely now, into each other. Now, I'll tell you other. where the video gets hot. Let's keep going. Where it gets like, here's where I look at, and she's sucking the tits. Right there, stop. Ah, right now. There. <laughs> here's the thing about you novices that don't understand how to hate women. When a girl opens her, her ass, ass cheeks, <laughs> she pulls her ass cheeks apart to where it's all asshole showing, mm. and dumps. In a cup. Moose. <laughs> in a cup. Mud cake. The weirdest shit, by the way, I've ever seen in, in all shit. I, yeah. I'm jealous of it because I wish I could have that kind of shit. I'm, <laughs> I'm constipated like you wouldn't <laughs> believe, nigga. My left eye goes starts to close up when I try to shit. I wish I could just... That kind of clear, clean, to the point shit right there. <laughs> to feel that empty, I would I'd kill to feel that empty. <laughs> Nothing works. I just can't shit how I want to shit. You need fiber, man. Oh, my God. I got to uh, shit. I got to go to Lamar's class to, to, <laughs> to shit correctly. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> this, this chick, dude, she shits this unbelievably foamy dump. <laughs> My mother might be listening, and her friends probably, so I'm just saying, mom, <laughs> this exists. Two girls, one cup is a phenomenon, and Needs we have to, to talk about it. This is a discussion. Your son is not into shit, but I'm explaining why this video is important to society. So she opens up her ass, boom, right there. That is what a real uh, so professional, professional at hating women and a porn watcher and a and a resentment guy towards women know why this video does something for people. I'm not a shit guy. So sexually it didn't do nothing for me, but I could but, but the I context of it. Yeah. The context is you get a woman, right? Okay, last night I had the threesome of all time. <laughs> <Wait. laughs> of all time. Like I mean I am very happy. I'm giddy. Yeah. Giddy. And hey, wait, let me ask something this about this girl. We didn't fuck her. She was on her period. And I hate bitches on their period. Man, I'm... And we didn't even fuck her. And it was the best threesome ever. <laughs> didn't even have intercourse with the bitch. Son, uh, we'll get into it later. Because you yeah. got a couple of ones. You, you had to trump me because you did a foursome, which made me mad. Uh. So I got to move back up to that. <laughs> but you didn't stop being a pimp. But you, I, we'll get back to that. Yeah. So what I told this chick, we had a discussion about two girls, one cup. Why this is, what the hatred is, is every day, like, look, Leah, you walk out, every day some guy is going to try to talk to you. Every day some guy is going, hey, how are you? Trying to figure out what, how he's going to get in. But what this does is, after I walked up the street, the other day I was walking up the street, I see this this girl, she was lovely. I'm like, man, I, I feel like saying something to her, I'm, you know. But I wasn't feeling like it was cold and she looked like she would, had somewhere to go. On a good day, I can out-talk a bitch that got somewhere to go. I can out-talk freezing weather and a bitch that got to make it to a job interview when I'm hot. I wasn't hot. So I said, ah, what made me feel good about walking by her was, ah, two girls, one cup. <laughs> That's what made. Do you understand that? That's what made me feel like 
I don't feel so bad. If I go, hey, how you doing? And the bitch goes, ugh. I saw a bitch in the butcher shop. I said, what you cooking tonight? She looked at me like, ugh. And I go, eh. Two really? girls, one cup. Them bad bitches is shit this in a cup. There's two beautiful women. And you can't say hi. And this is where the resentment is. Ah, that's it. The resentment is this. I have to do all of this shit to impress you. Car. Conversation. Personality. Sparkly jacket. F sparkly jacket. <laughs> Good hygiene. Gotta make sure my nails is clean, cause some bitches look like your nails. Make sure my sneakers are clean. Pinky my ring. My shoes are clean. My pinky ring shining. Watch. So that I can find out that you shit in a cup. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm trying to fucking attain to, is I find out, bitch, that you'll lick my balls. <laughs> Is why I have to give you my whole life. That's what makes a motherfucker look at a chick and go, hey, listen, wanna go out? I can't. You go, you funky Fuck bitch. Me, bitch. There's two bitches <laughs> that'll shit in a cup. Not Bad only you. shit Dimes. in a cup, throw up on the shit. <laughs> and on each other. He playing this shit, man. <laughs> Nobody, it's, it's horrid. Look at her. Look and if you and here's the thing, look at their faces, right? There's no take two. There's no director going cut, cut. Listen, you gotta be more into the shit. But like, I'm not into what she's doing right now, per se. I'm not into her twirling shit around in her mouth and showing you she swallowed it. And all. look at that. I, and this, this is here's what makes this phenomenal. It's the le look. It, 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 rewind that again. Just right to that point. I don't need to see vomit coming out, but to see a girl. She don't even. Self put her own. She takes three fingers and just. <laughs> she don't even buckle. And just. She don't even heave. Fucks her mouth with her own fingers and throws her. You get something where you go, you funky bitch. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for sh for Showing keeping us. me going throughout the. Knowing that my resentment is not wrong. Mm. That that the fact that I think women are the dumbest things walking the planet Earth, <laughs> dumber than even a fly that flies into, that sees one of his boys fly into the into fucking the... zapper and he flies right back. <laughs> That's how dumb I think women are. <laughs> for for holding on to an apparatus with such passion that we once we get because we have to fight so hard for it, we hate you. We hate you after we get pussy because we find out. You made me go through all of this to find out that you're just this, these two chicks. Look at her face. Look at her fucking dumb face. <laughs> She's gorgeous. But look at that dumb face looking down at a cup of shit and throw it. And the other one's like, oh, yeah. Are you fuck? You think you're different, ladies? Are you different? Yeah, no, you might not be in the shit. But did you think that you'd ever be choked? There was a time you go, oh, no, no, I would never let a man choke me. Now you get choked and slapped all the time, don't you? Spit in the face. Now, you, you, any ladies in out there get spit in the face? Any spitters? Any guys that spit in your face? Yeah, ladies? Did you think one day, you? do you think you could tell your friends, I enjoy being degraded, spit in the face? Yeah. No. You keep it to your fucking self because you know it's some degrading, disgusting thing that's not socially acceptable. But you're going to walk the streets... Not speaking to me because you don't want to fuck me. And there's two girls, one cup, walking around. Do you understand what I'm saying? There's two girls, one cup, walking around. And you're fucking some average mess. Some mess that I'm talking to because I think, you know what? I should be able to fuck her right now. I'm actually talking to you because I feel you're beneath me and you should fuck. But you don't. <laughs> you treat me like a beautiful bitch would treat me. And there's beautiful bitches that will shit in a cup. That should be the mantra. Two girls, one cup. Two that, girls, one cup. If a is bitch a doesn't mantra. say nothing to you, if you go to a chick, exactly. <laughs> give me that. As you say something to a chick, you're trying to give her your best. Your best. Hey, listen, you want to go out to dinner? Uh, hey, listen, let's hang out. And this bitch goes, no. You go, two girls, one cup, and bounce. <laughs> <laughs> and you go, I'll find you, bitch. I'll find you. Cause, Cause there's a chick better looking than you with that dumb face. <laughs> make, let, make the throw up face and then stop and go to the mirror. <laughs> and go look in the mirror and look at your dumb fucking face. Last night I'm slapping. 
a girl in the face with my with my dick. Happy birthday to me, by the way. Do you even know her last name? I'm, yeah. No, I don't. No, you don't. I, I know, barely I know her first name. I know. I had to take a lot of respect to learn her first name, but last name, no. Don't. No, one day I'll learn her last name, but it's really, <laughs> what need is it? It fucks up. It fucks up the, you ever see this this thing? I don't know. I, I, don't, I never, I seen it once and never seen it again. This guy was on the train and he, every day he would get on the train. I, I don't know if I said this already. Every day we get on the train and dry hump. You, you, you seen that? You seen that shit? You, you dry hump a, this girl's ass and she would be holding on to the thing and they would just have a dry hump session and she, they didn't know each other. That's an HBO thing. Was right? it an HBO yeah, thing? Yeah, yeah, it was yeah. a crowded train. A crowded, this is going, talking about your last name shit. It, the crowded train and he would go up behind and hold the thing while the train was crowded early in the morning and fucking just hump her ass. She would grind it and, and come. Every day they would do that. One day he got on the train. It wasn't that crowded. He goes, what's your name? She went, ugh, you fucked it up. <laughs> That's why I don't want to know her last name. Because she could be like, no, no, no. Because she was a trooper. She was what you call a submissive. And she ran into the right two pieces of shit. <laughs> Once I find out she likes to be in slap, dude, it was slap fest. It was like hot 97s. But... <laughs> It was like she was a fucking soldier, and she was young too, delicious, like 23, 22, something like that, and and just a, a dirty girl. And I'm sitting there, and you gotta understand, dude, when when guys say, ladies, when guys say we hate women, it's what we, it's cause of your pussy. We, it, that's all it is. It's, we don't hate you any above that or below that. We hate you because you hold on to such a high level apparatus that we can't just control that we have to manipulate out of you you know what i mean and it and it makes motherfuckers completely disgusted and frustrated do you understand that leah do you understand why we hate you i get what you're saying <laughs> i didn't I, I didn't realize that's what you meant when you were saying you know now now i understand what you're saying when you look at a girl and you're like what you think you're too good for me and i said two girls fucking each other and eating right shit. Girl, I get yeah. it. It, it, it two girls one cup stops rapes stops guys that are so frustrated that they go and rape a bitch stops that so because you go even money like how much would i could i pay you a thousand dollars to take a shit on film a g no face no face you just open your asshole and take a dump in a cup for a thousand dollars why not i just don't think i'd want me taking a shit on tape anyway no it's it's you, just your bottom torso purely anonymous, anonymous. it's not anonymous but it, first of all leah well, would need would help know. reaching back open up her ass <laughs> and, so let's say it's you and and like a little midget and, and two, two, two motherfuckers <laughs> <laughs> with, with with duct tape on each cheek, I pulling it apart. The guy with my ass you, yeah, but whatever the case may be, you take a dump on camera without your face. No, it's thousand dollars. No, two thousand. No, three thousand. No, four thousand. There's no amount. Ten thousand. Fifty. No. Ten thousand dollars cash in twenties and fives. Bam. No. Because I would know I did it. Twelve thousand five hundred dollars in cash to dump. Just your ass taking a dump. Twelve thousand dollars isn't that much money. Ready now. Those girls shit, ate, and threw up on each other. Probably for four dollars and fifteen cents. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why am I even? I went to twelve, twelve five. Twelve five. I went to. She said no. Do you understand why we don't like you? <laughs> Who says no to that? Who the fuck says no to that? Girls with your false morality. Why is it false? These two bitches. Two girls, one, one cup. cup. That's the new movement. <laughs> no pun intended. All you pussy ass niggas that's out there going yucky. The movement is not these disgusting tramps. Look at this bitch! <laughs> Stop that! <laughs> Stop! Oh my god! Look at the legs. Look girl. at this girl. She didn't even take off her blouse. Do you see her legs? She is a fucking dime. Mm. Uh, and look at this other piece of garbage down on her, on her knees, <laughs> waiting for this other one to throw up on her. Look at these bitches. Are you fucking kidding me?
Do you understand what this should change? This should put men on top. On top. This video. We should be now we should be running pussy. We should be all men should we should have a bunch of women running around now trying to get dick like the motherfuckers from I Am Legend. The um <laughs> that come out at night and chase Relax. dick. <laughs> like Will Smith. Omega Man. We should have bitches like that. Running trying to after these two bitches, they should have brought the value, the property value of pussy should have crashed just like the stock market. We should be bitches should be in a pussy recession, a dick recession after this. Look at them. And they're fucking dimes. Both. Gorgeous bitches. Look at this. Shake the neck and, and went to do it again. Look at this. Look at this gross shit. And the other one's just like, yay. Look at these two animals. And trust me, I know chicks that... It, look, man. I know chicks that we have gone from level zero to... Comparatively, if we were bank robbers... We went from, all right, look, this is our first time robbing Stealing a bank, gum. to going in the bank and then shooting everybody just so we don't have to deal with, everybody, get on the floor. That's what we've gone to. We've gone to gangsterism together. And I didn't shit. I'm not in the shit. But at some point, dude, we've, I've done things with women that if their mothers knew, like, oh, my them. God, my baby. Why'd you do that to my baby? And that's what they would say to me. It was why I did it to why I did it. Not why your funky daughter's funky, but why I did, I did that to her. <laughs> Why'd you do that to my, my baby? baby? My baby didn't shit in no cups. <laughs> <laughs> you done made my baby shit in a cup. <laughs> My baby's a cum shitter. You got, I'm taking her to the clinic right now. I'm taking her, oh my god, I'm taking her, she's gonna take her to the, to the fucking psychiatrist. She gotta get evaluated. <laughs> Doctor and the, and the girls are there crying. What's wrong with her? What's wrong with her? She's, she's shitting, shitting in, in cups. <laughs> I walked in and she had her ass open and she's shitting in cups, sir. Dr. Phil, what would you do? Well, what kind of cup was it? <laughs> a coffee mug and your ass leah wouldn't do it 12 for 12 five. five anonymous yeah. anonymous these chicks have destroyed their entire lives and you won't <laughs> anonymously you open micer you make four dollars and 12 cents every six weeks every fortnight <laughs> every fortnight you make a dollar right you wouldn't just take a dump without 12, your face five. for 12 five no. And it, why? Th and this is the thing. This is another reason why I'm right now. Why? What, the word yeah. why, when you ask a woman the word why, she'll never, ever, ever have yeah. an answer for why she has an opinion about things. She'll just go, no. Ready? And I think highly of your intelligence. Why wouldn't you shit in a cup for 12 5 and you're, and you're not, your face ain't even on camera. It's just your ass. Dumping. Shit fet fetish video. 12 5. Now I feel like I'm on the. I have to have an answer. Yeah, you do. This is a national radio how, show here, by the way. I live with myself, and the decisions I make, I would know that I was shitting on a video. I'd be like, "What the fuck did you do that?" I could make twelve bucks doing a lot of things. Really? What? 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 Right now? Well, I could get a real fucking job that pays you twelve five after eight months of labor. Whatever, twelve. You, twelve. You still not say now? why? Why won't you shit in a cup anonymously for twelve five? Do you understand what I'm saying? I Leah? understand, but that's the me reason is I don't think it's. You don't think? There you go. You you can't see her face. She's looking up and around. She's trying to figure it all out. Because it's, a, and it's Leah, an emotional and, feeling. And, and, and let me explain to you how Leah is. Leah's one of these high level bitches. Yeah. She, no, I don't get in. I don't get kooks in here. Yeah. I don't just want like if I got like some old dumb submissive girl that's stupid to go. I don't know. Leah went to school for some shit for hating sex, men. Sex uh, therapy. The bitch is high level. Got a degree in this and that. She runs her boyfriend ragged. <laughs> <laughs> he, I'm, I'm he, trying to think of an appropriate answer. What the fuck? Is this no, just say it. The, no, because you... I no no answer I give you is gonna no be don't try it now you're trying to you're trying to fucking double talk to make this about but why wouldn't you because I don't do anything that I can't be unanonymous about 
We said you're anonymous. I know, but if I can't be open about it, then I won't fucking do it. If it's something I have to be anonymous about, because it's clearly something I think is not appropriate. Have you done things with any boyfriend that you wouldn't they, share in public? No. Really? All right, give us a little you and Dustin well, action. Well, you and pub, you and the public is separate because you will uh, double it talk. Over do you understand? Over Listen over. to this, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Listen to the horse shit that they do. It's emotional. It's it's, a, it's, it's an emotional it's a, state. It cannot, she has an emotional feeling no. about what is about shit in the cup. This is why I like, and, and that's where her reality is based on her emotional state. This is why I like professors in here. You think I'm a bully? I want ten lawyer bitches up in this motherfucker. <laughs> you don't I want, want Gloria Allred <laughs> and her fucking best star. friend. Do you want to shit a cup and have your mom see it? Not my mother, but exactly. if she ran across it, yeah. and I wouldn't say, it How wouldn't much? be a sign on it that said, this is Patrice O'Neill's black ass with shit coming out of it. <laughs> this is this. Look. <laughs> How much would you shit in the cup for? Four dollars and eight cents. Because <laughs> <laughs> I shit in a bowl for free. <laughs> if somebody came in and said, oh my God, and, and gave me a real cell, like fetish, like, look, dude, listen to me, baby. There, there's a world, there's a fucking world where men jerk off to women taking a dump. It's called scat. Scat videos. Just like pissing. It's called uh, water sports. Mm. Okay? You come in. Here's what I need you to do. I need you. I got, I got $1,000 for you. I need you to just sit down. No face. No, you don't have to give, even give me an ID. Give me a fake name. But what I need is your giant ass. To squat down and just shit, not in the toilet now. Now, a lot of women would do the shit video if they get filmed on a toilet taking a dump. But we're talking, scat videos are like, ooh, it's coming out of ass, okay? Mm -hmm. $1,000, no face, don't even tell me your real name. Tell me your name is Susan. And all I want to do is just get a full back body shot of you just squatting and dumping. Here's a G. It makes no sense for you to say no. It makes total sense. I don't want someone taking a picture of me taking a shit. Hey, ladies, if this possible, could any woman who would take a thousand dollars to dump on a plate call in the show? Or any woman who wouldn't to just give me a full fledged reason why you would not an emotional shit reason in a yeah. cup, a real reason to make me go. You know what? Fair enough. That that's a good reason not to shit in a cup. That's why. I think, a I think it's a good I think it's a good enough reason that there's no amount of money where I would switch what my morality is, which is I don't want people taking pictures of me for other people jerking off nude. Which makes you an asshole because <laughs> <laughs> because there's two women because in the world there's two cup. girls in one cup. Yeah, but we got we got to take a quick break, right? Listen, we got to let me just give us the numbers the number to call real quick. If you want to give a call, it's eight six six wow one wow, which is also eight six six nine six nine one nine six nine. And here's what we want to discuss real quick. We want to quickly discuss this. It's a morality thing. We don't want to talk about two girls one cup. We want we want to. We, this is a philosophical uplifting about this thing. We want to take this video because I didn't look at this video like, oh, God, I'm just going to watch it. I'm just going to, you know, I'm turning on YouTube and some sissy on there going, oh, yeah, I'm going to get watch it right now. I'm turning it on. And then it's, oh, oh, oh my God, God. throw up. Oh, oh my God. Nothing. Look at Leah's face. She is mad. Oh, I'm not mad. I'm thinking of what a proper argument would be. <laughs> <laughs> like a linear, logical, Which makes her fucking argument. mad. She's sitting there competitive. I Shit. love that. I love that. I, you know what hatred is, women? It's sickness. And it comes out in the form of, I want him dead. It comes out in the form of tears. It's illness. And you'll feel better. Lee is already feeling better. She'll shit in a cup after this show. Oh, no, no. <laughs> a, a big cup. <laughs> we got a shit in a Tupperware. It'd be one girl yeah. and one a girl. and a boat. <laughs> yeah, no boat. Maybe a <laughs> so listen, we gotta take a break. Call uh, call back. Give the number one more time. Eight six six wow one wow eight six six nine six nine one nine six. We want to discuss, and I'm serious, dude. We're gonna hang up on you if this is not a philosophical discussion. If you calling going, I shit in a cop thousand dollars. If you do that, that's fine. But we want to discuss either why you would or why you wouldn't. Because we're trying to... This thing is indicative, man. This fucking video, this two girls, one cup, is indicative of why we don't like you. Do you hear this conversation? 
two fucking dimes are thrown up at each other, and Leah wouldn't take 12-5. 12-5. An anonymous dump. Mystery dump. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll be right back, man. It's Black Phillip with Patrice O'Neal. It is almost better than when a guy eats your pussy. What the fuck are you talking about, bitch? Hey, welcome back to the shitty program. If you if you missed what we were talking about in the beginning, grab your toilet paper. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry we're we're talking about doo doo so much, but it, it's bigger than doo doo. It's bigger than than doo doo. Try not to smell it. And I say shit and doo doo. I mean, it's, the word shit is much less disgusted than feces. Feces sounds. Ugh. Yeah, it sounds maggoty. Yeah, it's just ugh. dying. But shit, it's like fun because you use shit for other things. Like ah, sh- shut up. That's some bullshit. Shits you know, and giggles. Shits and giggles. So it, it helps. And we appreciate y'all uh, coming back here to the Black Phillip program where we're trying to help you understand certain things about life. I don't know what you've learned so far, but it's probably means nothing to you. <laughs> oh, we can go over a review later. We can just re- we're here but with the lovely Leah Bonham, who for the whole break has been sitting there trying to figure out how to argue with me about why her more this and is and this is such a woman thing is that a guy would go ah nah I ain't shitting gotta go girls go no I'm not shitting and you go why you loser excuse me <laughs> and she has to think of some amazing womanly way how she's gonna explain to me why she's not gonna shit in a cup now we're gonna take our first caller we're gonna talk to this lovely Viola <laughs> voila Vo- is it voila or viola viola hello viola how are you lovely I'm good. How are you, sweetheart? I'm um, not bad at all. I'm not bad at all. So listen, <clears throat> what's going on with the, uh, did you see the two girls, one cup? No, I have not seen it yet. I uh, I drive a truck. I'm not going to sit here and lie. And I just haven't had time to get on the Internet to see it yet. Well, you should get a, give that, uh, you heard about it, though, at some point in your adventures, right? Oh, yes. I hear about it on, uh, of course, the O&A show all the time. But. Right, right. And, I mean, it's hard. I don't know how deep they got into it. I didn't hear that part. I don't know how deep they got into it or what level they got into it. But I'm saying that, first of all, you're a, a truck driving woman. Are you, are you, what you look like? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not going to sit here and lie. I'm not, uh, I'm not a skinny little bitch, but, uh. You know, well, weight, <laughs> weight, weight has nothing to do with. I mean, I, look, when you walk down the street, a guy's trying to get a little bit. Some guys, not all guys, but some guys, yeah. So, are you fetish fat or are you just regular girl fat? I would have to say I'm regular girl fat. So, like what, like, what, what are you forty five six? I'm five eleven. Oh, you're a tall thing. So five mm-hmm. eleven, what two twenty? About two fifty. God damn. Wow. Lawrence Taylor, this bitch is... Whew! How old are you? I'm 27. Uh, you know what? I, I wish I could... Can we see you on the internet some kind of way? Um, Got any pictures yeah. out there? Yeah, I have a, a MySpace account, but uh, it's a bunch of numbers. I don't remember all the numbers. What's your... what? MySpace uh, what? What is it? Uh... Man, I ain't gonna give it out. <laughs> Why not, baby? What the fuck is wrong with you? It's my, you need MySpace friends. You'd see, this is what I'm saying. What the fuck? Uh, Why would you not give your MySpace out so we can see what you're looking like? Because there's a lot of people that listen to this channel that uh, actually don't really like me. <laughs> so what? Um. Okay. All right. So uh, fucking what? Oh, you played with a lot of hearts, it, didn't you? Let me see this big giant. No, let me see no, this fucking no. giant it's, here. Let me see here. She's an Amazon woman. Yeah, 5'11", 250. Holy shit. I'm, if I see him, I'm going to punch you in your mouth before I ask you on a date. Let me see. Hold on, Vi- Viola. What is it's it? has got my last name in it. My, oh, jeez. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Well, let's put, we'll put you on hold for for two seconds. Okay. We'll take it off air. All right. And then, okay. and then we'll put it on, okay? All right. All right, I'm gonna, so I'm going to put you on hold, all right? What's that? Okay. All right, cool. This is Viola. We're trying to figure out what the fuck's going on here. Cause she said she says uh, she's shitting she was shit for money but we're trying to see what she looked like. Oh, cause she just. <laughs> I remember the girl that What's called. The, what, what was the dimensions? 
She's 5'11", 250. 20, 27, 27 years old. Man, you know. <laughs> but we got to see what she looks uh, like. I'll fuck a 250 pound I know bitch. you will, but uh, we've established that uh, five shows ago. 5'11", <laughs> two. That bitch would beat Ricky Hatton. <laughs> I wonder if this is the same woman that called up ONA and shit in a bag and threw it up against the truck window for them. I wonder. It might be. I, I don't right. think it is, but, but uh, one woman did do that. Trucker woman. <laughs> Speaking of shits and giggles. <laughs> oh my god. So listen, man. Yeah, Lee, I Lee. feel fucking great. Yeah. You don't understand how great Thank I feel. You. you don't understand how great I feel, Leah. Super great. <laughs> Two women in a cup. You're sort of glowing so much. Oh that, uh... God, I had a great birthday. What an obscure number for a birthday to have a great. Uh, mine Did was... we do it? Did we do it? Yeah, I'm gonna pull it up right now. Let's here. see what this uh, Viola. Viola? I'm here. All right, we're going to try to look at your MySpace now and see what you're looking like. 27 oh, okay. years old, 5'11", 250, and you would shit in a cup for money. I would do it for money. As long as I was anonymous, I, I would do it for money. Uh, so just an anonymous thing? How What would it take? Let's let's get into the thing. Now, non-anonymous, you would do it for 1,000. Non-anonymous? Or anonymous. No, anonymous Anonymously, for a you would do it for 1,000. Anonymous, anonymously, yes, I would do it for a thousand. Shit. So for Un five, anonymously, it would have to be a lot more than that. <laughs> so five, Jesus Christ, baby, you are a big, you are a big woman. I'm not denying that. Wow. Holy, Holy I don't have enough dick for her, nigga. She looked like, you look like you got big hands. <laughs> wow, you a big mama. But I would take, I'd take you on, I think, though. How big are your titties? Um, they are 48 B. Did you say B as in Bob? No, D e. as in Bob. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> You're a little I was about to say, you need to drive off a cliff now. You got a, a B got big, cup? Big wide tits. <laughs> yeah, the wide, the, the big Jesus horizontal. Christ, I was about to say, you take one of them wide turns you see in the movies and shit, just go right over the ravine. Oh. All right, so you a 46 D. How big is your ass? Big ass? Big fat ass or flat white girl ass? I have a, I would say I'd have a um, big butt. Are you racist? About a butt. <laughs> Are you racist? No. You, you, ha racist? meaning this, a lot of big white women don't fuck with black guys because they're racist, but we're the only ones that really give you that kind of play. Actually, you'd be surprised. <laughs> you ever fuck a black dude before? No, I have not. Why not? We talk to you all the time. We're the only ones that try to fuck you on a regular basis. I know, and that's that's the whole reason why is because most black guys are just looking to get in your pants, and you know I'm trying not to be a whore. And 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 what and and she most white guys talk. trying to trying to love you. Um, a the, lot of the white guys, yeah, they're they're more in. To it for the relationship of it. And so. and you you have a boyfriend no, no, no. now? They just they just lie yeah. about it. <laughs> yes. You I have, have a boyfriend right now. Where's he at? Um, he's driving a truck right now. He is in Ohio. So he just has a long distance. <laughs> some long no, distance relationship. No, we actually drive for the same company. We meet up every week she's at the terminal. Trucker. And and he and then you actually said black. I can't believe she said black guys are trying to get in your pants and as opposed to white guys that are looking for love. This <laughs> that's is because they lie about it more. Do you see the misconception out there? And I'm glad you said that because that's probably some fucking misconception that that is a, is about niggas in the first place. That yeah. Look, we are trying to get into your pants, but I think black dudes build off a of pussy. I think a lot of black dudes go about it the wrong way. What do we go? Hey, you, hey, hey, you, you big, big lumbox, pull your pants down. <laughs> <laughs> We're not romantic. <laughs> As you big giant bitch, pull your drawers off. <laughs> you, you... <laughs> I'm, adding lumbox to, I'm adding lumbox to my repertoire. <laughs> Viola, lumbox. wait a minute. Hey, let, let me ask you a question. I'm fucking with you. Let me ask you a question. What, what, what was a couple of lines that a black guy actually fucking, you know, came at you? At? What was one of his lines that made you say what you're saying right now um let's see one of them was i just want to take you home and put you on my bed um just, that's kind of romantic 
That's no, that's not right. How did he say it? Was he? Did he have on a, a grass skirt and was he going ooga booga booga? <laughs> and a bone, a bone in his nose. Did he have a? Did he? Was he trying to break down the fence after he was just chasing his white woman back from the jungle? <laughs> did he say that while he was on the Empire State Building? <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it was uh, it was about the second sentence that he had said. Uh, the first sentence was "Hi, how are you?" And then uh, look, I'm gonna be honest you with know, you. I'm gonna be honest it. with you, Viola. You, yeah. you got you got to kind of you got to take that. I mean, you got to that's that. Look, I, I know my strengths and my weaknesses, man. You you're five eleven, two fifty. You yeah. you gotta like who likes you a little bit. You gotta like, and I'm not saying you gotta just, you gotta fucking like deal with. De- <laughs> you gotta, you, you know, you don't have to deal with disrespect, Viola. But at least like be open to that, man. Well, I mean, well, let's be honest, man. Come on now. What What do you? In all honesty, I, I've been herself. disrespected a lot growing up, and and you're just not gonna take it no more. And exactly, I'm not all about disrespect, you know. How about dirty? How dirty are you? Are you a filthy girl? I don't understand you're not about disrespect, but you shit in a cup for a thousand dollars. She's still on this shit in a cup thing. <laughs> I thought that's what I was talking about. All right, fuck it. All right, fuck it. You're right. Mom, Let's go back to shit in the cup. And it's money. It's so if somebody mom, pays it's for it, it's, if somebody money. pays for it, it's more hoary. If you shit in a cup for free. Go ahead, Byron. I, I, I wouldn't do it for free. I ain't lying about that. I wouldn't do it for free. I'd do it for money. It's a thousand dollars. She do it for a thousand dollars. Yeah, Everybody diesel did. fuel costs no, money. I'm saying that if she do that for a thousand dollars, and and then that's like it's then what? So the she's trying to say she's trying boring. to say she's trying to say your morale ain't shit. She's saying you're doing like for a little bit extra, you would do something else. Would you fuck a black guy for a thousand? <laughs> no, I wouldn't do that for a thousand. Two thousand? Nope. Three thousand. Nope. Now we're getting not, into being racist. Four thousand? No. <laughs> Five, actually, four thousand is racist. Actually, I wouldn't have sex with anybody unless it was in a relationship. Uh, see, my mind. I've, I like trying to figure out how to talk to you about this right now. With over, you have to, your head, I have to get even... in a time machine to go back twenty years. What? What? Who? Why would you think that? First of all, you're not in a relationship. You like a guy. And he likes you. You're not together. Never forget that. You're not together. He's with you and you're with him. And if he left you, you would still be with him. You understand what I'm saying? Right. So what is this relationship thing is a is a farce. You're not in a relationship. Would y'all stop with the fucking bags? Um, (laughs) Y'all are not in a relationship. You're in what they call uh, like my girl got jealous the other night. She got jealous and I had to tell her her jealousy belongs to me like you can't be jealous unless i let you be jealous because you don't you don't own me like i'm not your property this is not your territory i i give you territory like the government gives indians territory i give it to you or i take it away it's not yours by right you understand what i'm saying so when you start thinking i'm only gonna do this because i'm in a relationship that's your own bullshit figment of your own imagination like one of these movies out the enchanted or the shit with the polar bears got voices that's your little world where you go to feel good about yourself. Narnia. Yeah, Narnia. <laughs> where you feel good about yourself for doing stuff without the label of I have a boyfriend. This is why girls don't want to do threesomes. Because they don't want to be labeled as this whore. But that's you living in labels. Because because how you think you're in some have you like you in a relationship just to be in one. But what what are you what are you doing that's that's so amazing? Well how's your relationship amazing? How is it amazing? Here we go. Because we communicate, we talk Ugh. on a regular basis. Oh, God. But you only see each other once a week. Are oh, you joking? That's like, a, a, that, man. that's like a weekly booty call. Oh, my God. Yeah. Un- <laughs> under the guise of we're under- in a relationship. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh my God! But, but think he fucks like around on you? Do you think? I had sex with him. You, you think? You think he? You, yeah, good question. You think he fucks around on you? No, I don't think he is. You don't think he's getting no side pussy? You think he's waiting no. for your 250 pound pussy every week? <laughs> yes. Without getting some truck stop whore to give him a little head or something? Yeah, one that weighs 125. And you wait. And you let me ask you something, Viola. Do you do everything sexually? Are you a sexual trooper? I am a very sexual person. No, do you do everything? Yes. Do you let him bang the folds of your stomach? Oh, will you stop, Drew? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. Don't 
Don't oh, say that, Drew. Hell. Don't say that about this fucking giant. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say that shit about this fucking middle linebacker. You don't say that about fucking <laughs> Gulliver. You don't say it about Dick Buckets. Don't you fucking ever say that about this six foot, pound, two hundred and eighty five pound woman. <laughs> Are you an asshole, Drew? Get the fuck out, man. Drew, get out. Don't just disrespect people who took the time to call in. All right, Violet, look, um, we, we, we figured out your shit in the cup for $1,000, and you think your boyfriend's not cheating on you, so I don't know what to really add to your life. <laughs> yeah, Rosie. Except for good luck, I hope when you come out that closet from Narnia that everything is still... <laughs> you have rosy cheeks and dignity. Good for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, fucking Large Marge, come get him. <laughs> All right, let's discuss. All right, bye, Viola. Let's discuss something real quick. Well, let's get Bob off the phone. Bob in, in, in Kentucky. Oh, Kentucky Bob. Bob, what up, boy? How you doing, son? Hold on, man. How are you? Oh, I'm all right. How's life, man? Oh, it's good. You know, just uh, taking it easy lately. Okay. Um, I just uh, had a little comment about, uh, what's her name, Leah? Leah. Oh, Leah. yeah. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Yeah, what about this fucking bitch? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I don't know her personally. I, I just Clearly. Have opinion on, uh, I don't know her personally. I know why she feels she won't do it for 25, or what is it? 12,000, 12, 12,005. 12,000. Listen to me, Bob. $12,500 can buy you a lot of what in Kentucky? What can yeah, it buy? Yeah, a lot of what? Fucking Crystal whiskey meth. or something? A lot of stuff. Well, you, you can know, do a lot of things with twelve five, right? Two trailer houses. Properties, yeah. Properties a lot cheaper down here. Twelve five. Yeah. Do you hear that? So you, you're yeah, talking. Yeah, money to... is. If clearly money was my you would not goal for a in house. life, I wouldn't have become a comic. Like I would have gotten a real fucking money making job out of college. So I don't really care about money. But what right. what could you do? Let's 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 base it on, let's base it on, hourly <laughs> wage. Okay. How long would you, would it take for you to squeeze out a good dump on a plate? A minute and a half. <laughs> Have I eaten well that day? Mm. Yeah. minute and a half? Less than a minute and a half. It's a good one. So 40, right 45 wow. seconds? Yeah. So who makes 12500 every 45 seconds? Let's say a hedge minute. Fund managers. Huh? Hedge fund managers. Huh? Hedge fund managers? Are you, what are you, an asshole? How many hedge funds? There's two of them. <laughs> <laughs> I, but it... They Money make well, well, I don't care. Hedge fund managers make twelve something every minute. Hedge fund managers this year, one hedge fund manager made nine. What every New York City public school teacher made all together in nine years. In, in one year. Uh, in one year. But we're not talking about that. We're talking about in a second. Well, they make a lot of fucking money. I don't think twelve five. That means that boils it down to twelve thousand fifty thousand an hour. Yeah, you have to be like Bill Gates. To pull that kind of fifty thousand an hour. You make it. I'm saying that you're gonna make fifty thousand dollars an hour. I can't shit that much. It's like six hundred thousand an hour. Oh right, because it's a minute. Yeah. So you made a million in an hour. Ooh. Um, I still wouldn't do it. It's still not about the money. That ooh was very interesting though. <laughs> ooh. I was more thinking about how Dante was good at math, and I was sort of shocked. Really? Really? Leah, come on, Leah. Stop playing. Stop playing. <laughs> it's, it's not about My man money. Bob is calling you a liar and not making him feel any better. Are you calling me a liar, Bob? Yes, he is. Well, no, look, look. It's, it's not about being a liar, but it, it's her not understanding. See, man, like, you, you get women together. Like, she understands that there are other women listening to this. And, you know, you have a chick. Like, I have a chick next to me. She's like, oh, she's a fucking whore if she does that, blah, blah, blah. You know. So your but, girl wouldn't take a dump in a cup. Put, put her on the phone. Put your girl on the no, phone. No, wait. I want to hear the rest of why I'm a liar. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, man. Sorry. Uh, sorry, Bob, because no, I get excited when, when we, we, we <laughs> fucking got him in a corner. Go ahead. Yeah, so she, um, if it came down to it, man, and, and you know, if it was anonymous. Now, everybody knows it's going to be anonymous, so obviously she's going to say no. But if it came down to it, like like tomorrow, you you type in Leah or whatever, and you see that her ass on TV, and she's actually shitting in the cup, and you're like, oh, see, look, twelve five. See, I, I just I just think she's kind of lying to herself, not really, you know. Oh, I see what you're saying. Like that I'm you're full of myself. you're full of shit. You full <laughs> of shit. <laughs> you're full of shit. Phony is actually, what you're saying. I just wouldn't. Why? <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Ask your I girl. Think, ask your girl I know, why. I don't think shitting in the cup. It's not even shitting in the cup. It's having someone tape you shitting in the cup. So what? And dude, okay, Bob, what, what your girlfriend is you? what? What's your girlfriend? What is, what is her situation? All right. See, like, all right, I just dropped her off, but this was at the at the time. But like, I told her, what if, what if they gave you the camera and put you behind somewhere to where they couldn't see you? You shouldn't have come. Ah, 
Very good, very good, Bob. So basically, basically, he, you do it yourself. You film it so, and then you sell it. You sell your own shit video for a G. Right, I understand that. Nah, I still wouldn't. Uh, ha, ha, ha. I wouldn't. Yeah. You know, don't you ever have something you wish you didn't done and it ca you carried around in your head? You're like, fuck, I wish I didn't do that. No. Well, I've never been tw paid twelve five to do something, but I'm sure I wouldn't have been regretting it as much. <laughs> See, he's it calling is. you an asshole, Leah. That's, That's what he's fine. saying. I don't live in Kentucky. And I agree with you, Bob. She's a dick. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Bob. Thank you, dude. Listen, let me tell you something, Leah. Let me explain something to you, man. I, look, I want to talk about my threesome. Yeah, Go why ahead. don't we move on to that? That's what I'm yeah, doing. Really? Should we? <laughs> <laughs> fucking liar. I'm not dusting shaving. I'll go back to shitting for another hour. I still wouldn't fucking take a shit and tape it for $1,000. You wouldn't do a lot of things because we talk off air. Leah, Leah has a lot of dignity for no reason. <laughs> I do have a lot of dignity. You ever do a threesome? I'm not talking about it. You what? I went to yes. college. That's a yes. So, did, so you a did yes. a threesome. So I banged a lot of chicks in college. Is three chicks count? No, I guess. Tell Can't us about bang it. bang a chick anyway. Tell us about it. Tell us about it. No. This is a lose-lose. Tell us. Stop fucking playing, Leah. Le Go ahead. Uh-uh. Tell us about the threesome. You just told us. Okay. No, the question was, had I heard a night? That yeah, and you said yes. And then you gave us a detail that we didn't ask for, was that it was you three. and three girls. No, it would be it me and two gr girls, because it would be three girls. I don't get it. So oh, I'm sorry. Girls. Yeah, okay, I get what you're saying. Okay, I'm sorry about that. Okay, so so you so you and two other girls, how did that happen? Tell us the the, the the beginning of the day. I majored in women's studies. That's sort of what you do. So you go like this. You came. One of y'all came, and y'all said, "Let's let's study for a test or something together." <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm 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 tired. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, let's get the scenario going. <laughs> so you you so you walk up to a chick, right? Or you you and your homegirls. What's their names? I'm actually not going to talk about this. So you walked up to him, right? You you walked up to him, and y'all, what, what the scenario, <laughs> give us the, the how the scenario ended up going to the next level. Like, where was, where did y'all originally meet that day to have it unfold? You can keep asking the question, so I'm not going to answer it. Just talk to us. What is going I don't want to talk about my sex life on the radio. I think we're going to talk about your sex life. <laughs> yeah, but everybody's sex life is open. It's open season, man. I'm, people know about my sex life, but they don't know about yours. Right. This like, is for people. People way. on the radio like to know about people and who they're dealing with, man. You could be a hero to a lot of women out there. Stop being typical right now. This is what this is being a typical woman. I'm oh, not, now now he's gonna win by being like you're a pussy, and I'll be like, okay, I'm it's not, not a pussy. pussy. It's yeah. just like asking a woman why she wouldn't sit. Like you get some women that say it's the same reason why I wouldn't shit in a cup. Like that's what ridiculous. That? So let's. It's like okay, when when you ask a woman her age and she goes, oh, I don't. You don't ask a woman. Her you don't age. ask a woman her I'm age. I'm thirty. You know what I mean? Mm. And then they and then they go. You go, why wouldn't you, what, what does that mean, not asking a woman her fucking age? And she don't even have really an answer yeah. for you. And I'm not saying that you, you know, it's fine, you know, you say your age, but what you're doing now is like, we go, hey, so what happened? You said, you already told us what happened. So you, you weren't, you apparently weren't ashamed of it. Yeah, I'm not you, of it. so what we're saying is, we're leading up, we're not asking you if you stuck a tongue in her asshole yet. <laughs> we're asking you we're probably asking you where did the being... scenario begin like meaning how does that you woke up in up the happening? morning you woke up in the morning you went to the class your girl debbie and your other girl Susie said hey you know what you doing today that's what we want to hear how did lead how did it all end up with three fucking twats out. Three for JJ's? There you go. Why don't you start sharing first, then maybe I'll feel more comfortable. Why don't what? Sharing? I met a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Tuesday. Met a chick. Okay. Talked to her for a minute. Found out, as I'm talking to her, found out that she... She likes you gotta, girls. Wait, you gotta put the other part in. What got you to that point? You don't have to mention... You could be vague enough. <laughs> oh, let's bring that up. You don't want to talk about that? Yeah, because it's a, it's a situation where, first of all, it, 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 here's what you're doing. Leah, you're not good as you think you are. <laughs> you're really you're really an amateur. Amateur at, at, at mind games. I'm telling her right now. She You'll only get of, hurt. She don't have a lot of practice. Um, yeah, because she it's who she who she spars with. Yeah. 
Okay. So what I'm saying is, this is she still exists, and this is what I'm, I'm trying right. to do this Tuesday. This, yeah. So you and these two girls was an old school whatever. Now I'm not saying you have to say her name. Like what I'm on, what I'm doing is like I don't want to say the bitch's name brand. Da da da. You want to know what is the, the the what is the what's the procedure to get it to that? Okay. Like now, what we, happened? When we talk we talk about threesomes. A lot of times we have specific rules of engagement that mm-hmm. gets you to that point. And right. People, well, what ha- what happened is luckily we met. I met by myself a soldier. Okay, I didn't know she was a soldier, but she had a great conversation, dude. Like she was like, "Oh, um, yeah." I said, "Do you like girls?" She goes, "Yeah, I like girls and da da da." Dabble and you know, and I go, "Well, listen, it's my birthday Friday. <laughs> Happy birthday to me." She's like, oh, "I got something to do, and I don't know." I said, "Look, look, this will be a great thing, and you'll be doing me such a service." And then we get into this thing where she's been with girls, she's been with guys. But she's never been with a couple. Bing, bang, boom, bing. <laughs> I said, look, that's when, and it's hard to, when you're in the moment of manipulating, it's hard to remember what you said. Right. Because you're just, you're just being the, reactionary. You're in the zone. You're she in the throws zone. a hook, you lean yeah. back, and, right. and you had to throw a jab. So I'm, when, it, when it comes to threesomes, <laughs> the conversation is always what they would call a, 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 a counterpunching. Right. I'm, right. I'm counterpunching. You know what I'm saying? So finally, we set up the thing for tomorrow, to, to for Friday. She uh, she comes down to my girl's job on Friday. Sit there, have a couple of drinks. That's always good. Okay. Uh, talking shit, you know. You know. You know. Finally, we go. Okay, it's time to go. Go home. Go to my house. Okay. My girl's sitting there, and I'm trying to do what they call damage control, <laughs> where I'm trying to make my girl comfortable enough. To not fuck up the thing. Right. She, where she's like, why'd you, why'd you open the door for her before me? Uh, and all that stupid shit that bitches fuck up. Who even cares? But you gotta be cognizant of that shit. Right. So I'm, everything's going smoothly. The bitch is easy going. She's one of these girls. She's easy going. Straight up. Not talking too much. Not fucking, not going ill, not going out of. My girl's being a little, like, you know, worried, you know, young broad, about 23, 24, something like that, 22, yeah. something like that. So we get to the house. We sit down for a second. She sits on the love seat over there. I say, well, I sit right here next to me on the couch. My girl gets to go to the bathroom. I tell my girl, listen, come on to the bathroom naked, all right? So she's like, all right, go to the bathroom. I say to the chick, this chick is already a fucking trooper. I say, let me take this goofy belt off. She gets up, takes it off. I said, let me see your booty. She's like, well, it's not a crazy big guy. I go, look at bitch, you here? Get ready to get ready. To buy like, look, show you should see me naked, motherfucker. So, <laughs> wait, I, trust me. <laughs> if you told me, well, you get up naked, you get up and show your ass. I'm like, this will fuck up everything. <laughs> so, so she's she show me a booty, okay? I, takes her shirt off, had nice, uh, nice D cup tits and mm. nice tits too, like the you know young, yeah. perky tits. Oh my lord! <laughs> she had the natural tits that old bitches want to get. Try they, they, to, they try pay to, for. They go to nip tuck for. Yeah, nip tuck bitches. <laughs> she had it for real. And nip tuck titties. She had them for real. So she fucking gets on the thing. She gets, first thing she asked me. This is how you know she's a giver. She goes, "Is your girlfriend getting mad? I don't want to do anything." And she's like already down with the system. Mm-hmm. Holy shit! My girl comes out nude because you know she's a fucking animal. She comes out naked like, "What up?" She's not even, she not even trying to be sexy no more. My girl's like, what up, nigga? Is she, <laughs> we, we doing this or what? Nigga, this, bitch, this bitch is pussy out yet, yo. Because it's just shit. Like, yo, what she do? What she it's about? So she about her about it? We doing this? Was she what? still playing elevator girl at that point? <laughs> <laughs> she come out, yo, nigga. So the girl, I'm already sucking the girl's titties and everything. So my girl sits down next to me. She starts, you know, my girl, your girl know what she likes. So she starts looking at my nipples. The other one, just like a good girl. <laughs> my girl pulls my dick out. This other one goes straight down and starts sucking my dick. Like, with, like, with not, vengeance. not even like, should I do this? With bad intentions. Like, with no <laughs> inhibition, leaning down, just. Like a, you ever seen them, them toys that you pull it back and they just like yeah <laughs> the, the like bird. Like the what's, the what's bird. that what's that thing um from uh you ever see uh Dark Man 
And, and shit, that bird. That bird that, that hit the lighter. That's how that bitch went down. Like the dark man bird that fucking blew it. And she, she, she just, it bird. just, she just. I pulled her back and she went right down on my dick. Like uh, I looked at my girl because we've had our share of threesomes. I looked at her and went, oh, oh boy, like what? And my girl looked at me like. like and she Look saw my book. face and saw this this young broad like going for broke and then my girl got into old woman competing with a young girl shit. Yeah. She's like, There's no way I'm gonna let this bitch suck his dick like this. So she <laughs> she said, Move over, bitch. So she went my girl said, Oh really? I'm going to the balls. And my balls was I felt good too, because you ever you ever shave your balls and dig in there? Yeah. And, and you just it just it was so clean that I felt like it sh somebody should be licking them. They were beautiful balls. I even put my leg up on the sink like a bitch to get any to get ass, ass hair I can get. <laughs> any ass hair I can get, I was I was fucking um, you know, I, it was clean, man. I was smooth balls. I felt. You know, like if your breath smells really good, and yeah. you're just like, I'm ready to kiss, baby. You should kiss me. <laughs> my breath is impeccable. That's how my balls in that area was. It was pretty. So I'm just watching a strange broad suck it. And my girl, I couldn't see her face. Because now I'm on the couch. And I'm, you know, my, my small of my back is hanging off the couch. And I'm leaning up. My girl's face had disappeared. All you see is the top of her her nugget. And but you feel her like moving, balling moving me up. ball up, and the other chick is <laughs> right, and I'm just sitting there like, oh Lord, have Happy fucking birthday mercy. Me. Now, here's where the chick steps up her game. <laughs> she and this is why this was the best threesome I ever had, cause she was fucking us. Any other time, it would be Yo, one is more with, fucking yeah. me than her, my girl, yeah. and then some would be the girls could have no use for me. Mm -hmm. Like, why is he here? <laughs> and I'm just like, I don't care. I just want to watch. You know, <laughs> he's like popcorn at the movie. <laughs> this chick would alternate in between us as if to say she had a natural mechanism that would go, oh, I haven't been doing anything for him in the last 30 seconds i better go over here sorry i would keep sucking the dick in the ball thing but he looks lonely there she gets up starts looking at my nips my girl looks she sits on top my girl sits on top of me and we start fucking this fucking animal and i mean this with all due respect i love her the girl gets up goes behind like my girl's facing me on the couch on the couch so she's we're riding she get the girl was licking my nips and vaughn gets up and ooh, well she, yeah cindy gets up and fucks me <laughs> <laughs> so she gets up and she's riding my dick and then the girl goes she goes oh I, i'm just kind of being useless right now i'm gonna go behind your girl takes my dick out of her vagina sucks it puts it back in licks my girl's ass then licks my balls bing, bing, in bing. in succession like bing, bing, bing. the uh it's the thing, the game from Bob balls. Barker this music <laughs> the, yo, the, yo, the, yo. like she would go <laughs> she would go out suck balls asshole my girl was making a face like this oh. fucking animal <sighs> she couldn't get enough man <laughs> negro mm. so here we go and and I, I will say this and you know me I hate bitches on their period. I don't want them near me. She was on a period, and she still was. I we didn't even fuck her. She was the best threesome girl. It was crazy. And of all time, didn't even fuck the girl. Okay, let me just say that because she was on a period. But it was such a momentous energy that I kind of like. <laughs> I kind of pulled the panties down a little bit, told her kind of lift the clit up so I could just like lick it a little bit, <laughs> and my girl pinched me really hard on my. Like if you nigga, if you eat this. You this throw me out the business. house. You throw me. <laughs> you throw me out the house when I'm on my period. If you lick this bitch's clit, <laughs> get this. If you lick this bitch's clit, I'll kill you. So she, I go, okay, fuck her. She didn't say that, but that was what the yeah. pinch was. So basically, I go get the um the magic wand, nigga. Mm. I go get the magic wand. 
put it on low. Because, you know, I'm trying to get this bitch a little pussy play. Right, right. I put it on low. She's she's going crazy. I put it on high. She's going, she finally, because she's such she a soul, it. she doesn't even make girl noises. She just was, she just was like, l- l- the only noise she'd make is what she was doing. Like, if she's sucking the dick, she's only hearing... <laughs> and she's looking at ass, she's only hearing, blah, 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 blah. She, there's no, uh, uh, it's just like, blah, 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 blah. so finally, I put the magic wand on high. She starts, that's when she starts going, uh, uh, so my girl hops on her, they start kissing, my girl never kisses another chick, really? she kissed her. I was like, this is going to be great. <laughs> <laughs> this is fucking great. So she's kissing her. And I'm rubbing, and then I do, and this is another thing. This girl, dude, we, I, I, she has to, we have to keep her around. So you know, I do the the, the squirt finger pop. You know, right. and I make, you know, the girls squirt, squirt while I'm finger popping. So I'm finger popping, and my girl's squirting on this other girl. Didn't flinch. <laughs> the chick just laid under there and went, ooh. <laughs> while I'm z- ooh, ooh. ooh. <laughs> she's nothing like crazy. She busts a nut. Then I start fucking my girl from behind. The chick turns around, gets underneath there, starts licking balls. Didn't mind you. Not saying a fucking word. It's me. She just went, oh, well, I'm useless now. Let me make myself useful. Balls licking while I'm hitting hit my girl. I'm like, wow. Now. Trooper. Trooper. Now. My girl gets on the couch. Her butt's in the air. I'm looking at the asshole, the other girl's looking at the twat. She got me on a butthole and the other girl on a twat, and my girl's going, she's grunting like a nigger. <laughs> like, ugh. <laughs> 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 uh, oh, shit. What? <laughs> she looked back. <laughs> she she sounded like DMX. DMX. <laughs> <laughs> what? I was like, what? Oh, shit. My dog. Oh, she's grabbing the fucking couch. Nah. Ugh. I'm like, oh. Bravo. Oh, so, so. Now, my girl turns on her back, and me and this girl are both eating a pussy, and then we both start doing the Flavor Flav, um, <laughs> kissing. No, it's just despicable. <laughs> We're kissing the each three, other three, and the munching on Vaughn's twat. Them. And usually Vaughn gets, she gets pissed if um you if kiss I kiss him. a bitch. But this time around, she uh, didn't. It was in the moment. In the moment. In the moment. So here's where we go. Here's where it gets like, it's nothing sexier. We was in the living room, son. It's nothing sexier, right? <laughs> There's moments. That's how you know when you get creepy, because you have moments of filth. There are. It's nothing sexier than saying, come on, let's go in the bedroom, everybody. Pie, pie. And naked everybody. bitches are marching <laughs> in your bedroom. <laughs> Just, you will not know what, I have to use the word ecstasy. Mm. You don't know the word ecstasy till you go, all right, everyone. Let's Into go. the bedroom, <laughs> and nude bitches are just getting up ugh, off the floor, off the couch, and they're marching, in. marching into Naked and the dripping. fucking bedroom. <laughs> marching into Narnia. And 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 I smacked them both, <laughs> smacked them both on the ass, and they did the smack ass hop. Oh, chop chop, right. bop, <laughs> bop, bop. Okay, here we go. This chick. Not my girl. The other girl dived in the bed. She did a a, a double Lindy <laughs> and landed a ten right on the bed. Lay down. We started doing the thing. Finally started. Um, made my girl come. Did did my girl finished her off. This chi- this chick came. Then after they came, of course, my girl knows how to. You know, she goes. She starts directing. All right, you get over there and you get over there. Lick the nips. Lift the nips. <laughs> After I after I kiss on my girl, I mean after I finished my girl off, I started kissing her a little bit again. Then my girl came down and we started doing the three the three people kiss, nigga. Oh man, it wow. was tongues in there. Oh, nigga, I felt good last day. Wow, ah, you wow. missed the part. You missed the part. Oh wait, we are getting to that. <laughs> All right. So here we okay. go. This chick is a submissive, so I'm grabbing her by her neck. Okay. Okay. Right. Spit in her face. She goes, oh, she spits again. This is her first time spitting. This is how you know she's a, she's amazing. Never spit before. She's a prodigy. She's a prodigy. <laughs> it's like if you get into a fight, right? You stand out there, there's 25 people getting ready to beat you up, and you go, God, I need someone to help me. And then Wolverine comes out the, 
<laughs> Wolverine comes out the door and goes, are you okay? I go, man, these 25 guys are getting ready to fuck me up. <laughs> Wait, don't worry about it. Ah! I go, nigga, Wolverine. Have, this bitch was the Wolverine of threesomes. She came from the god, the threesome gods. So she, I'm spitting in her face. She's spitting in mine. And she's just rubbing. And then she says to my girl, you come spit in my face, too. My girl, me and my girl are just spitting in this girl's just, face. And she's just like, <gasps> first, oh, God. And first reason. oh, God, oh, God. Just, uh, and I finally bust maybe the third best nut I've ever bust. <laughs> of all time. Of all time. Of I would say time. of all time. Like, uh, I go, ah. Uh, you did a Lexington steal. My girl walks out. She goes, she knows I don't want to be bothered. I push the other one away. She walks out too. When she seen I don't want to be, she was, she did anything she was told to do. Nice. Son. I, and then, coup de gras. She stayed over. No threesome bitch stays over. But she got in her little room. Go to your room. Go to sleep. I'm tired. Well, I go, should we go? You want to, you want to go home or you want to be? She goes, it's up to you. All awesome. right, here's a here's a, a fucking sheet. Go in another room. She closed the door and slept later than we slept. <laughs> this bitch ain't shit, and I love her. And she ain't shit in a good way. I love this girl. What a fucking trooper. And here's the funny thing too. At the end, like we was all chilling, winding down. I was making a uh, uh, fruit smoothie. <laughs> I made a uh, peach and pineapple and nice. mango and strawberry peach smoothie. Peach smoothie. This is good. Doing that, and I'm, she goes. So she did had a little bit of insecurity. She goes, "How um how, how was, was I? How was I?" I go, "What are you fucking kidding me?" And I go, "I go, you must have been molested when you were younger." And she goes, "Yeah." And I said, "I ah, figured." <laughs> Tell your uncle I said thank you. <laughs> Because any chick like that has been molested, man. Any chick that's sexual, like, because touching she's 20, creeps her out. She's so young. Touching, like, soft touching makes her feel creepy because that's how she was touched. Some soft touching dude was touching her. And now she just, she wants to get, have it sexual feeling but not have that closeness because it, it, it reminds no her of that. No intimacy. So she likes to just, just get socked in the jaw a couple of times while she's fucking, dude. Boy, we, we really... Yeah struck filth gold mm. filth gold that's the white unicorn right there oh my <laughs> god dude i'm sitting my girl goes maybe we try we should try to hook up again um on on uh, new year's eve i said bitch uh what are we why, doing why not tomorrow? tuesday <laughs> what's wrong with you wait, wait, but i gotta let my girl handle the show that's another thing yeah. she gotta handle i don't Card have the rule. chick's number the rule. it's like the only contact i'll have with this bitch is for my girl so I, she'll be like, my girl will be like, so when you want to hook up with her again? I go, oh, no, I'll leave it up to you. And I'm just trying to beam in tomorrow <laughs> for my mind. Tomorrow, Jedi bitch. Trick. We're not doing anything tomorrow. <laughs> I just need, tw and my, my, my balls are killing me. I, and I want some more. Mm. I, matter of fact, I wanted to fuck my girl by herself. Without the girl, I get more attracted to my girl after we have a threesome, yeah, son. Absolutely. And I'm looking at her like, mmm. Like, I never, oh. I never, my girl's looking at me like, and here's her girl shit. She's looking at me like, oh, now you, you don't know. never want to fuck me twice when it's just us. And I'm just like, of course not, bitch. <laughs> uh, no, this bitch, what do you care? What do you care? Just what makes me want to fuck you twice? So I'm just sitting there touching. She's being all like distant because I had a conversation with the chick. And she's like, you shouldn't talk to her. Why don't you ask her to go get you something to drink? So she couldn't, she couldn't <laughs> she just to. stay. She had to be a chick. She had to be a bitch. But I think it's working out well because I'm going, like, my girl is a filth ball in terms of, like, liking sexual feelings. Mm. I'm like, let's be honest, man. Come on. You got your asshole and your pussy leg at the same time. What do you, what do you want? What, what do, do you want? want? Does your girl not understand how 
she looks better in your eyes after this. No, no, girls are dumb. Remember that look I said? Remember that look I said? Go get ready to make yourself throw up and then go look in the mirror. <laughs> That's g- girls every day. Mm. That's their dumb face. <laughs> <laughs> Sweetie, we just had the greatest threesome of all time. <laughs> That's what she. That's what they do. So I had to talk to her for a fucking hour, because mm. this is what leaning up. Oh, leading up to, this had to be two, uh, Wednesday or Thursday. Um, we couldn't get in touch with her, so we was like, maybe she we, she wrote the number down wrong. wrong. So we call a friend of mine that knows the girl. So let me get that girl's number. Um, you know that girl such and such I was talking to. Let me get that number. She's and he's like, all right, right. And then he gave me the number, and then my my girl's like, I don't like him. She was sitting right there. I don't like him. Why? Because he he didn't even ask. He didn't even ask, like, where I was. <laughs> That's bitch politics. You dumb bitch. I said, mm. I said, why would you? No guy would do that. Like, I was like, the nigga said, look, if my daughter was, I wouldn't snitch on my daughter's boyfriend <laughs> if he was cheating on her. <laughs> That's how we're wired. Like, I like, look, Dante was was married. He was married. Now he's not married, but he was married. And if that nigga got his dick sucked in the alley, and I saw it, and I seen his wife, I would still go, hi, good to see you. And I would still have the same love I have for her and the same love I have for them as a couple, but he getting his dick sucked. I would never think, I would never think to say to him, you're not with her anymore? Yeah, you, you think you should be doing that? That's not right. Not your Here's business. what a girl would do. If her friend, if a girl goes to another girl, <laughs> girl. and says, and says, hey, listen, can I get that number to that dude? She, the, her first, the girl would go, you're not with Patrice anymore? Did y'all break up? What happened? Why'd y'all break up? Bitch, I'm trying to get side dick. What <laughs> is wrong with you? <laughs> That's what the fuck is wrong with girls. This is what's wrong. This is what I'm trying to teach you, Leah, because you have potential. Thank you. You have a, a potential to you. But do you understand why, if the guys, we get together and it's like, okay, what happened? What happened to that threesome thing? Now, you're going to entice us with the fact that you did a threesome with three girls, and which you don't hear about. The and details. then you're going to keep them details to yourself for no other reason except for to be an asshole. Because much, yeah. for no other reason. And then that's and, it's, and it makes for radio that people hate. People go, who is this? Did you, you? So, no, no. The guy had a thing. The guy said, get, that get uptight this bitch, uptight bitch, bitch off the, the air. She, he, he hung up. He hung up. Did, get, oh, yeah, but that was also followed by way to ruin a threesome, Patrice. No, that's the message board. Don't pay attention to that. Oh, that was exciting. No, no, we're talking about we're talking about when you we go all right, wait, the threes, and we know it's going to be a good story, and you go, no, I'm not going to say that. Like, you can't be a fucking girl on this radio station. Then you want me here because you have somebody to pick on? But you don't, we don't want to, we want to pick on you and get you to actually grow in some direction. But you're so used, you're so used to just being in control in your fucking silly relationship because you work more than your boyfriend does as a comic. And it fucks with you. It fucks with you. Like, because you're too in control. You got too much control. Look at him. It's, he, he, he understands it, too. We know it's an arrogance about you, Leah, which is fine, but your arrogance is based on not even having a philosophy, really. You're just arrogant just to be arrogant. No, like I have you, philosophy. Like, you'll just go, no, I'm not. And then that's it. That's why it, it, That's why guys don't like you. Not you, but you're kind. Right. I have philosophies, though. That's oh, what's true. your philosophy on why you, wouldn't, you would tell us that you had a threesome with women and won't give us any details? Because the question was, had our head and I? And I order, like, do I And you answered it. You, why don't yes, you just go, none of your business... On every level. Now, I'm not telling you on any level. Not gonna, but you told us the best part, which is the ending. You told us the best part. The best part was you did a threesome with three girls. No, two girls. What, whatever. Three girls did a three, did a threesome. Three girls. You engaged with three girls sex, okay? And you wouldn't tell us the details, but you would tell us the ending. What, what, that you had it, but yeah, but but did not get the details. I was details. answering a direct question. But why? Why? The question is why <laughs> wouldn't you give the details? All right, Leah doesn't want to talk anymore. All right. She doesn't want to talk. I we won't ask any more questions. She's on the radio just to to uh, judge. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> to just mess to, up fun. To make faces. I'm here to mess up fun. She's on. She's on. She's on the radio to make faces. That's what she's here to do. Leah making faces, Drew. That's what it is. She's making disapproving. This is what I'm going to do. Faces. We ask her a question. She goes. Hmm. That's what she's doing. Some type of 
defiant womanness right now. She's doing this for all the ladies. Right, ladies? This is how you do it. Yeah. This is how you fuck up a radio show, girls. <laughs> this is how you fuck up a radio show. Yeah, we're not talking. What would she do for 12 hours? Hey, get Brian on the phone. Get Brian on the phone here. Let me ask you. Go ahead, Brian. Brian? Well, we're, we're out camping. Brian. And we want to know. Yes. You Are you there? Yeah, yeah. I'm here. Okay, go you ahead, me? man. All right, we're out in the middle of nowhere at this lake, and me and my buddy want to know, what would she do for 12 five? The point is that it, does, it doesn't matter how much Holy it is, I fucking shit! Do, it. do you see why we hate him, Brian? Are you are you, are you and your friend? Are you are you are you you and your friend killing women where you are? <laughs> no, they're out fucking each are. other because they're, they're in the fucking way. Uh, wait, yeah. hold on, hold on, Brian, yeah. hold on, Brian. Repeat what you just said. I Leah. said they're out in the woods fucking each they're other. They're fucking. Why are they well, fucking each other? What are they doing in the woods? They're just hanging out, but they have to be gay now. This is what I'm no, saying. No, but no, you're no, gay. No, but you won't tell us why. <laughs> no, I've definitely what slept with women. You you're, you're, you're a faggot. <laughs> you're a yes, faggot. <laughs> you're a faggot. Why are you judging him? He didn't say he was a faggot. You're a faggot. No, you slept saying, with why women. Why would you? Why would a guy who's out in the middle of nowhere with a guy call and ask? They're having a relaxing. Yeah, make. they're having a chill time. What, you know why he's what there with his friend nature. in the lake? Because his. He hates you see women. what you just did? Because you'll ruin his good time <laughs> in nature with his buddy. You'll go, hey, guy, and this is the mosquitoes. Where do you shit? Gay? I can't no, do it in the woods. Right, right. Right. He's out there chilling. What? You guys, that's so old. We've been getting the broke back shit all the time. I know. And it, we're not right. giving it to you. That's, that's, that's exactly. Out, that's you. Hanging out, fucking drinking some beer. Exactly. Fishing. We just want to know what she would do for 12.5. What would you what do for 12.5? Nothing. Besides work, what fucking bad thing would you do for twelve five? I would do bad things for money because it would make me feel like shit about myself. Now you said you licked asshole before, right? And, and I you did, did it for free. free. What the fuck? Do you understand what it makes no sense? It makes total sense to me. It makes only sense to women, and as we know, y'all are dumb. It makes sense to women. For Come you on. to say yeah, you're you licking an asshole for money. free, there's something you do for twelve five. You're lying, Leah. I'm not lying. What would you do for twelve five? I'm not lying. What 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 would you do for twelve five non sexual? Non sexual. I'm so, I'm so what, what happy that you fucking called just to call her out because this Immoral, is God, God, calling me out. God, he's so calling you out. God, and you, what you're doing now? Do you know what you're doing now? For money. You're pleading the fifth. You're not being honest right now. That's what the <laughs> problem is, dude. This is what I'm saying. He's out there. He's fishing. He's catching a couple of salmon, sucking some dick, and he just want to know. <laughs> 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 I'm, 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 I'm fucking with you, Brian, nigga. So listen. Okay. I, we understand where this no, call came from. That's why I'm I had to answer the call. Great, but I'm staying on the same. All right, thanks, I wouldn't Brian. do shit for money. All right. sexual. Yeah. All right, great. You know Samantha. I Samantha. That's why you like me. Hello. What's up, Samantha? Are you What's are you up? here to fucking join up with this useless asshole over here, or you're, <laughs> are you going to fucking actually make sense? Well, I just, I, I told, I, I said I'll take 12 five to shit in her face, because, I mean. On my face. <laughs> yeah, thank God. <laughs> thank you. She'll, she'll take 12 five to shit in your face. <laughs> thank God. I'll do it for free. <laughs> what was it, but for 12 five, you know what, she'd probably do it for the five. <laughs> just the five, just shit in your face, because she knows you're bullshitting. You're supposed to be I'm to help uplift though. women. This, but man, I'm not bullshitting. Samantha, why is she bugging you? Why is she bugging you? I, just because she's trying to act like every other, I mean, that's, y'all, you give us Go ahead, say it, every other. Act, wait, wait, hold on, wait, say that again, woman. say that again, say that one more time. Just every other woman on, you know, on the radio, you sound like a whole just, you know, you won't admit to anything. You, just, you won't admit you to say, any wrongdoing, you're a phony right. is what no, she's I saying. No, I think I just wouldn't get paid for it, for it. that's all I'm saying. Explain what you did, I mean, give the details, you already said you Now did. let me ask you a question, Samantha, if you lick asshole for free, why you wouldn't you do it for money? Let me ask Why you this. You? If you, you if you lick a, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this, right. Leah. Would you take Leah, twelve five after yeah, you lick the ass? After you lick a guy's asshole, like, you know what, and he goes like this, you did a good job, bitch. Here's twelve, Here's 12 five. five for licking my asshole. Would you take it? <laughs> no. All yeah, right. Yeah. She's a lying asshole. Lee, I can't believe uh. Leah's sitting here fucking lying. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't. I feel like a whore. Which she is comfortable yeah. with, but I'm not. That's kind of a so, nice so free ass thing. licking is not a whore. Yeah, because I fucking enjoyed it too. So why not so you can't take twelve money. five on top of because it? As an appreciation, did you would you take dinner before you licked his asshole? I split fucking dinners with people. It's all the way I think. I just don't think like you. Yes, you do. No, I don't. You think? No, well, you don't think like me because I'm a man. 
You think like you, but I'm telling you how you think. Do you always split dinners? Always? Or, or sometimes you never... one person pays and then the other person pays, but, but I don't expect people do you to take a buy me shit. She, she fucking, Leah hates men, which is why I'm very frustrated with her right now, but this is beautiful because she fucking hates men. She doesn't take anything from men because she doesn't want to owe men anything. Fucking right. I don't owe anybody ah, anything. I don't take shit from women either. Ah, I don't take shit from anybody. Leah got hang-ups. You got real problems, Leah, and that's what I like. I'm fucking out. Now I'm liking her again. You have a fuck. You have issues disguised as this chick that got it together, but you're a fucking sociopath. <laughs> you got you got shitting in a cup in your future. Because <laughs> you're an ass licker and a girl fucker. You're a faggot and a shit mouth. And you're sitting here trying to have dignity because you're not taking money. You're just a fool. No, 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 no. A fool for no. eating pussy and 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 and, and what does she else she do? Lick men's asses. I like for girls free. asses too, for free. Girl asses, man asses, for did you lick, free. Did you lick a girl's ass in that threesome? Of no. course she did. No, I didn't. I wasn't to ass licking stage yet. She, you, so you grew to ass licking stage for free. Absolutely, because it, it's. Different. You know what she's like. You like. A, you're like a person. You know what you like. Here's what you like. Here's the, here's what makes sense of it. It's like a gir- a guy who plays um, the guitar by himself, and he he ends up being this amazing guitar player. And then somebody goes, "Listen, we want you to do a concert, no. and play this guitar, and we're gonna give you a million dollars, man." And he goes, "I will not do it for money. I'll do it for free. Just for the art. For the art of it." I'm so would you do out. this for for the? Yeah, would you do the show? That- so you would lick asshole for your own personal glory, your art. So you <laughs> should art really, ass. according to your point of view. You shouldn't really get paid for comedy, because you love comedy, don't you? No, we aren't talking about... Wait, 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 wait. Mm, no, it's the same the logic. And here's the thing here. Mm. Here's what I'm going to start doing with you. I, I, have to, I have to fucking... I got to take the gloves off with her. I got to force you to answer the questions. All or right. not. Or not. Would you, would you do comedy for free? Why don't you do comedy for free if it's something you love and you don't get paid for doing something you love, i.e. lick an asshole? Because... <laughs> I'm looking asshole of somebody that I care about, and I'm in a relationship. Yeah, but with you're them. doing comedy. You care about yeah, the people. I don't give a shit about the people. You the don't care about the people. I like, hey, I hope you care about their life. laughter. So what you doing? So you're would using you, them? Would you would you give a shit about the people who watch you watch you in a video shitting in a cup? I wouldn't shit in a cup in a video. I'm saying you said you don't. You said you wouldn't accept the money. Let's 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 keep this. Let's not bring shit up no more. Let's All just right. keep this trying to keep it. Let's logical. just trying to keep me keep in focused. Because what it was, what you're doing is you have a you have a, a, speci- a you're trying to say you have this logistics or ph- a philosophy about what you will and will not do, but it doesn't logically it doesn't work across the board. So it's not a real philosophy. No, you're but just, it, it it's has your to emotional- do with sexual things. But it, it's not. It's not. A, it's still a philosophy. The philosophy goes across the board. Just because one is doesn't make the other one the same. Like they're not relatable. They are relatable. Yeah, they are relatable. That I mean, is, and that's the problem anything. with women. Yeah, they that's don't what relate. we're doing is relating anything. That's why you have to come up with analogies to make somebody who's thick-headed and won't change their mind come up with an analogy that makes sense to have to have them have that point of view. Okay. Well, so what I you're saying change. is you love comedy, right? Yes. You love licking asshole. I love licking a particular person's asshole. But you, but so what? So if that particular person, after you licked his asshole, said, "Here's a couple of bucks, kid, go get a cab," you wouldn't take the money. No, I'd be like, "I'm not a fucking hooker." If he says, "Thank you so much," here's your money. I'd How about like, if he no. says, "I love you," here's a cab, here's money for a cab. I'd be like, "I live here, bitch." You know what how the about, fuck we're saying? How, how about, no, no, I she does. Wouldn't. She thinks she's good, but she's not. All you're really doing is not answering questions like girls do. Like knowing Leah, Leah thinks she operates on this high level, but what she knows how to do is she knows how to just not deflect answer the question. She deflects. Answer. You're a great deflector, but every mm-hmm. woman is. But it's transparent, though. It's transparent. But you want to be. But you. But you want to be this I, cool chick no, who people I, think different of. But you. You. No, you're even worse. You do care. What I, what You're lying. I don't see you do care what okay. people think. Do you care what people think? Of course think? I care what people think. All right, think. then why would you say that lie? Because I was joking. D- you weren't joking. I was this being is sarcastic. beautiful. I like this. This is fantastic. I was being sarcastic. Okay, go ahead. Keep being sarcastic. Let's be real now. Okay. Let's be real, Leah. I'm ready. Okay? You're an ass licker. I have licked ass. <laughs> Which makes you an ass licker. And how, many an ass, ass licker. how many ass Everybody licker? Everybody in this room is an ass licker. We never said we wasn't. Well, but you are an ass licking faggot. <laughs> yes. I'm not arguing But you that. won't be that for free. 
I mean, you'll be I that for be free. That for money. You're an ass licking fag for free, is what you're saying. That's it. That's With your label. People. You're an ass licking faggot for f everybody's. A, look, I can lick a thousand assholes and that be particular. Because that's not everybody's asshole. So one or one thousand. Right. So you're an ass licker. I'm fine. A with dirty that. little ass licking dyke yes. is what you're saying. Yes. But you won't be one for, for a couple money. of dollars. Explain that to us. I have to rethink the way I think in order to explain <laughs> it. Exactly. That's do you see why that, we can that, never, that, ever that lose? That is a good answer, though. Ladies, that, ladies, do you see why we can't I'm trying lose? trying to think like you think. But that's so a good answer. Let, let, me, and let, me ask you a, let me say something to you. This, fellas, did you hear that? That is called the, the uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Not the disintegration, the, the um, dissection. That is called the dissection of a fucking woman. Because here's why they they go, fuck that. I'm not going to talk to you. Because you're afraid to lose what you have with her. I have, we have nothing with Leah. All Leah can really do is go, I'm leaving. Other than that, she has no power. That's why chicks, when you ask your girl that you love questions, she goes, just leave me alone. I'm not going to fucking talk like that. I'm not going to do this. Because you can't put her... Push the get the bitch up against a fucking verbal wall, and she starts. Did you hear her? Did you hear her face? No, but I'm trying her, to make it her, sense. her her mouth was moving like her face. Like no, but her I face was sounding uh -huh. just like her mouth was moving. <laughs> she was going. Louder. She was going. I, I, I did hear it. There you go, well, good girl. The, and she goes. I, 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 I have to rethink. What the fuck are I we talking? I have to explain the way I, I think to, because I don't think but like here's, you. But here's, uh, well, let me say this: the the that rethink the rethink is a step towards. Understanding that your philosophy is bullshit in the first place. Ah, that's the first step. I like that. Wow. I like that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Uh, one. Uh, that's what. That's a, that's five. Uh, Give Drew five too. Leave her hanging. I don't mind. Leave this ass licker hanging. Leave <laughs> this ass licker. I don't yeah, like that. Start. I'm not gonna because touch what she's oh, the fuck. Hey, look, we gonna take. We got, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. Uh, go to Chris because he's a, go to Chris. Chris. What's up? Tell tell hey. this asshole what's going on. <laughs> I'm always the Leah's asshole. Leah's an asshole now. Go ahead, go ahead. You all hear it, right, right, Chris? Right. Do you even right. hear this asshole? She's an asshole. Yeah, yeah. And everybody, yeah, right. everybody, if you don't say, "Hey, Leah, hi, you asshole," when you answer the phone, I'm an asshole, we're gonna hang up on her. So you have to, <laughs> when you get on this phone, if you get on the first, thing you have to say, "Hey, what's up, Leah? You I'm fucking asshole." asshole. Don't get paid. All right, go it's, ahead, Chris. The, what's up, Leah? You asshole. <laughs> <laughs> And somebody can anyway. explain to me why I'm an asshole. Okay, all right, check it out. Because you don't make you sense. You said that you wouldn't do this for money, right? Right. Okay. Technically, when Patrice or anybody buys you something, that would be a form of that, would it not? I, I believe I previously said because I don't let anybody buy me anything because I don't well, want to Dustin owe doesn't buy you nothing? We have joint right. money. Oh, mm -hmm. nigga, please get the fuck. You know what? It's this is su on such a level. Leah is so sick that I put up my medicine to kill her. I don't even. <laughs> I gotta go in my medicine. I gotta go in the basement to get the medicine that kills wow. Leah. <laughs> Clear off the cobwebs. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> this is like going back to 60. This is like going back to when there was typhoid flu. You know what? What's funny? What's funny is how she snuck under the radar. And you didn't even All know. All these fucking, because you got to understand people out here listening. Leah comes off like fucking Gloria Steinem, who you fuck. You know, Cor Gloria already. Yeah. She's a hard, but she's really not. She's just a fucking girl like all the rest. <laughs> I totally and it am. makes me sick. Because I exactly. thought you was this so, gangster. If she, takes, if she takes the money, she would go and buy that stuff anyways. So if you bought it, it would be a form of... This whole, it's the bartering. Whole, 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 it's barter whole, whole, system. Is why money's worth money. Basically, what he's saying. You, that, that, it's joint money. You've pimped your man into fucking having joint money. You can't. This is disgusting. Chris, thanks for calling. I think. Let me talk to Kevin. I got. I'm rifling these niggas off because they hate you. <laughs> I'm glad. Go ahead. Hey, what's up? Hey, Patrice. Hey, uh, uh, Leah. What are you saying? Uh, Wait a minute. We have go. to make sure he calls Leah. You <laughs> fucking asshole. Go ahead. Hey, uh, Leah, you fucking asshole! <laughs> you, got me so, you got me so fucking worked up. I'm trying, I'm trying to put this out. Where I'm so glad. The way I'm taking it. <laughs> now this is your your him and a hawing ass is going. This is why you're going to find out all through life. Why every fucking dude is going to tell you to get your shit and get the fuck out. Nobody's because ever you, told you, me you that. You basically ask, you act like a fucking cop, tease. I mean, you sit there and talk about it and try and turn shit around, but you're going to find all your life. This is why dudes going to say, you know what? Fuck this shit. Get your shit, get the fuck out, get him in the hall and ass. That's not true. 
Nobody's ever told me that. Ass, there's yep. plenty of pussy ass motherfuckers that'll put up with it. There's motherfuckers that think this is that, sexy. And that's why she's so good at it now with the guys that she's with. Because there's plenty of guys that'll put up with the bullshit Absolutely. over and over again. Absolutely. It would be a, a perfect world if a motherfucker would say, with your him and her and ass. Thanks for calling, Kevin. Mike. All right, see you. Mike. <laughs> Leah, you're an asshole. <laughs> Here's, wait, before you talk, Mike. Don't even try what you're doing. It's another technique you're trying to deflect it before it comes. Nigga, I did that in high school. Still call her an asshole. She's enjoying She's it. trying to make it corny. I know what you're doing, Leah, but Mike, we're going to hang up on you if you don't call her an asshole. That's not Leah, you free-licking asshole. <laughs> ass, you're an ass-licking asshole. Ass asshole. Sissy. He said free-licking asshole. Leah licking eats asshole. pussy. Leah <laughs> eats pussy. Yeah, pussy-eating asshole liquor. What you got to say to this ass liquor? Uh, you know, this just points out the fact that women are so full of shit. Thank you. She's always deluding herself. Thank you. Sex is dirty. Sex is all about being dirty. Women try to pretend like they're better than us when they want it just as bad, and they're going to go around pretending like they don't want it. The fact of the matter is... I didn't say that. that. Uh, we don't care. No, but you're acting Defend like that's, yourself. That's fucking illogical, because I didn't right. say that. I didn't say I don't like it dirty. <laughs> I didn't say there's anything wrong with dirty sex. I Wait a minute. I don't fucking want it. <laughs> Look at... Leah's an asshole. <laughs> lick, lick the asshole. Is everybody on here is calling her a fucking asshole. Wait a minute. It's your demographic. It's a bunch of it's, fucking it's, guys that like you. <laughs> they can't be intelligent guys that hate horse shit coming out of people's no, mouths. No, I think you're very you're intelligent. You're full of shit. I mean, she's two she's men, she's one she's cup. That's the mantra. It's two, two women, one, one cup, cup, nigga. That is the movement. You're an asshole, because there's some sexy bitches out there that are shit in the gut. Yeah, Listen, we're going to take a I break wouldn't. and I come back. We're answering. It. Wait, don't go nowhere, because we're going to talk to Tom and Rob. With you're an asshole. You're an asshole. Fucking asshole. Fucking asshole. No one thinks I'm one. You can come. You can go na 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 na. You can. Hey, listen. Anybody who fucking agrees with this ass licking sissy, call me. Call up if you want to defend this homosexual ass licker. Because I don't want to get paid? I don't see why that's wrong. I it's not wrong. It. It's just idiotic. We're going to take a break. We'll be right back. It's call Patrice O'Neill on the Black Phillips Show, 866-WOW-1-WOW. You can call. I will, I'll listen to you talk about nothing. That's 866-WOW-1-WOW. It's any up time, bitch. I'm a pimp. Crank that up. Black porn music. White porn music is that music. They go, whack a whack a whack man. Fuck me. This is produced. There's a bitch in there singing this for money, by the way. She actually has a great voice. And someone paid her a couple of hundred dollars to actually sing a song. She's probably in a video, too. She's a lyrical she's a, genius. She's a singing whore. I bet she she sings for yeah. free, just like you. Oh, I, I, well, I've got... And she got paid. Now, what's the difference between her? Hey, do the, do three big dicks. Three big dicks. Play three. <laughs> you got to get to the rap. The rap is crazy. The, the rap's off the chain of three big dicks? It's hot. All right, go. <laughs> what's the name of this particular video? Three, three big dicks three and one dicks. Spanish chick. Three big dicks. <laughs> Watch how the little beater runs away. Watch how the little beater runs away. Three. Three. Oh, shit. Three. Wait, turn this up. Oh. Watch how we all rip off her jeans. Watch how she gets and when she begs and screams. You know when she begs and she screams, she slides on in. Dick on her mind, dick on her chin. Baby, what's your name? Tell me what's your sign. Dick on your breath, dick on your spine. Have you ever had a dick all up in your mouth? Have you ever had a dick all up in your mouth ready to smash? You can look up in my eyes and all you can see is nothing. Call it a cream pie. I know a hoe when I see a hoe. Look into my eyes, baby doll, let's roll. Everything you want, I got you. This is, by the way, black porn music. <laughs> this is this is not some shit you'll find on some album in the West Coast. You have to buy three big black dicks, one Spanish chick. <laughs> 
What? Watch how the little beater runs away. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Dude, I want to bump that in my car. <laughs> that rap is crazy. Three big dicks. Watch my dick on her head. And then my dick going to be in the bed. Three big dicks. Holy shit. Oh, God. Welcome back to three men and one asshole. <laughs> Just to take it out of a sexual context, just to show that I'm illogical all around, I volunteer with kids, right? Parents try to tip me. I won't take it because I think that in certain things, you just don't take money. You're just a general idiot is what we're coming up with. <laughs> That's fine. But I just want to show that I'm an ass all the way around. It's not like I'm a hypocrite. Uh, go to Tom in Detroit. Tom. Hey, Leah. Uh, yes, Tom. You're a fucking asshole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, 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 hold on. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Robert in Indiana. Robert. Oh, are we just going to go through an asshole? I just don't want to look at Yeah, I know. It's bothering you now. To make sure, turn it up in the studio so she can hear it, this fucking asshole. Robert, go ahead. Hey, Patrice, I just wanted to thank you. I think you saved my marriage. Oh, thank What's you, sir. What's your advice on women? What's my advice on women? Well, hell, I bend over backwards to my bitch. We've been married 10 years, right? Mm-hmm. And, you know, about the last fucking year or so, I've been listening to you, and I started to hurt myself being a prick a little bit. That's right. Listen to this, you fucking... Wait a minute. Hold on, Robert. I said I was going to hang up on people, but I'm not going to do it to you, but you have to call her an asshole before you continue with this story. That bitch is an asshole. Thank you very much. I like <laughs> he had his bitch. The bitch too, Thank you. Know. She don't like this. Look at her. Oh, you can't see her. She's inflamed. I'm not though. She looks oh, like. Shit. I don't know if it's going to be on air. I just wanted to thank you because. Hey man, you're welcome. And that's, you know, this this is a man, long. All fucking boats, all that faggoty shit, man. I asserted myself. <laughs> right. Shit. That's right. Awesome. All of that. Thank you for calling, Robert. Let me let me tell you what he's saying. All that book fact because it's see everything that. Everything except for this show deals with both point of views. This show, I want to deal with one point of view, which is the man. Because we don't get to deal with our point of view. And why is that? Why is that? One kind of man. No, it's not one kind of man. There's only one kind of woman. Exactly. That's the point. That's exactly. There's There's one kind of guy. But it's all one type of woman. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, man. The thing is about this show is is the reason why somebody would call in you. And does that guy sound like he's a hoo-hoo, he's a dumb guy, he's a faggot? No. He's a guy that he's a guy that is with a woman that he wants to be with. But she makes his life miserable. Yeah, but you make us miserable. You, no, we don't. Now, the reason the reason that you make us miserable is because the reason that you'll make... See, not many men make m- women miserable the way... I'm making you miserable right now. No, but all men, you know, women. Okay, how do, okay, ready? Okay, watch, assholes. watch what happens. Watch what happens. Why do we make you miserable? Go ahead, my dear. Why do men make me miserable? Uh, or what? Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, I can't start with the question. I can't, I can't <laughs> clarify. Fuck. Go ahead. Because you love logic and you can't ever expand your mind to think, oh, maybe I could think in a different way. Maybe I could just try to fucking understand something. We do. We try to understand you. You try to understand it through your point of view. No, we, we try to understand. At you. least we have a point of view. We understand. I have a it. point of view. We, it's just we one we you underst- don't agree with. You don't have a point of view. Yes, you, ha- I do. you have a feeling, which is a point of view. That point feeling of view is not a point of, view. a point of view. Point of view. It is a feeling. Ugh. It's a hunch. It's Ugh. Like where you come from. Ugh. A point of view is where I come from. Blech. Blech, I just ain't shit. Blech. No, I'm telling you, point of view is not where you come from. Yes, it is. It's a your point of, point of a view. A point of view is something that you actually ha- you you manufacture through thinking. Right, and I believe some and, things should be and, paid ha- and for not, and work, and, and some not, things aren't and work. And not linear, but a, a a a progressive point of view, not just a straight, flat line, dead point of view, but that you go, okay, hmm, like right now we're not having a back and forth. We've come up with so many logical reasons. Why you should take money for sex for being an asshole liquor and a girl who eat pussy, but you won't take money. Do you realize that's the theory of a hypocrite? No, You're it's a not. Hypocrite. I just won't take money. <clears throat> You're a hypocrite. For I wouldn't doing... take money for a lot Why of wouldn't things. you do take money for things you do for free as an appreciation? I just we exactly. I don't think it's right. And that's my point of view. B- Bill, he's an asshole. Leah's asshole, and I will straighten her right out. <laughs> <laughs> and how will you do that, young man? I will do it long, deep. <laughs> <laughs> she sounds like she needs it, doesn't she? Oh, just 
repeatedly. Just a, a vicious I fucking. I this guy's horrible and bad. Yes, yes. Why, why, just, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Hold on, Bill. We're trying to deconstruct this woman here. Why is he horrible in bed? To feel the need to call up and be like, dude, I could f fuck that bitch straight. Mm -hmm. He clearly has a fucking inadequate city issues. Maybe there's nowhere on this planet where a guy can call in and say that at any point in time on the planet Earth. Maybe we're the only place but where I a do guy get can... get fucked regularly, and I get fucked well. Ooh, how's that? It's great. What is it? Give, give us a little something. <laughs> but does she get her asshole licked? <laughs> <laughs> That's what that Bill. That's the, the question. Point. Thank you, Bill. What, he's asking the question. Where did you get your asshole licked? I don't want my asshole licked. You're an asshole licker. She's a licker, not a licky. Yeah. I like that. Nice licker. Good girl. Uh, Rob from Cleveland. Yo, how's it going, Patrice man? Go ahead, man. Hey, uh, I just wanted to say, you know, Leah, you know, you were respected to your, your, uh, entitled to your opinion. Hang up on him. <laughs> Hang up on him. You're not, she's not entitled to her opinion. <laughs> and he is <laughs> saying he's an asshole. Big Papa, we need to talk to Big Papa What's right now. Hold on, Patrice. Come How are you? Leah, you asshole. <laughs> I'll get to you in a second. Drew <laughs> Boogie, you sure are a stud. Patrice. <laughs> I am effing in love with you, brother. You need to write a book. I'm trying to be a man. He's right. I'm telling you right now. Do you hear his passion? It's going, be, it's going to be a bestseller. You need to write a book on how to be a man, brother. You are phenomenal. Nah, now, did you hear that, you asshole? Call her one more asshole before you hang up on her. No, but I like you. That's why I'm here. I think you should write a book. Listen, honey, listen. I love you to death. You know why? Because you are sexually just, you're in it, you're a dirty little girl, and you love it. Now yeah, He loves you because you did admit that you're an so, asshole liquor, by the way. Right, I have no problem with that. A gay your asshole liquor. <laughs> no, I fuck chicks in college. No. It doesn't you're mean gay. gay. Your you're views, gay. Your views are so skewed, they're retarded. They're working at McDonald's wiping down trays. Yes, that's, that's right. Abuse her, Big Papa. Your views are. Thank you, Big now, Papa, for this, calling. Hang up, hang up on Big Papa. Now, now we need Joe. Joe from Arizona. Joe. Hey, you Ruby Starfruit eating asshole. <laughs> Ruby <laughs> Starfruit Starfruit eating, 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 eating asshole. It went from chocolate starfish to Ruby starfish. <laughs> yeah. How did that happen? How come you get Man, to I eat guess. ass and nobody says anything, but when I eat, I ass, eat a woman's ass. Sissy. I eat a woman's ass. I know you did, but you won't. But talk you're about a woman, it. homosexual, and you won't talk about it. I ate a woman's ass, and I'm a guy. You eat women's ass, and you're a girl. I Lee don't eat is a sissy. Ass. I have Lee eaten. is a sissy. Huh? I have eaten. Which yeah, is I know. Not, I am eating. I can't believe someone who licks asshole of the same gender can have this type of um, elitism kind of <laughs> attitude. She's an asshole licker. It's an aristocracy. How can how can a free and a free asshole licker? <laughs> exactly. She's a volunteer asshole licker. <laughs> a volunteer, talking right. to me. Like she's, you're an asshole liquor. And I'm proud of it. And, and you're proud of it, but you're not proud to take money. This is why you are losing this whole thing. This has nothing to do with people thinking you're dumb oh, and da-da-da. Let me ask this for, oh, Sean. go to go to Sean. Sean in uh, W.I. was Wisconsin. Yeah, I need to agree with this asshole only if she means that she wouldn't take money from a stranger. But if you're taking... Your boy, and you're licking his ass. That's like step 240 in a relationship. Taking cash is like step four. What you know, he has here? a fucking fantastic point. Let me tell you something. Thank you for calling. I really appreciate that, Sean. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Here's why licking an asshole, you are a troop. I think it's the dirtiest mm -hmm. thing a woman could do, by the way, is licking an asshole. Mm -hmm. I think that's the dirtiest thing. Because you can, what, taking a shit? Yeah. Let me tell you why the, the act of it is just filthy licking an asshole. You got the guy's dick holding it. Then you, you got balls, okay? So right there, you're a soldier. So you got the dickers up, you're licking the balls. Now you're getting to the asshole. Close. You have to. You got to really search you for You have it. to put, put your face <laughs> under the balls and lift and hold the balls with your <laughs> temple. And then you gotta... stick your tongue out and lick his crevasse. And you got you to gotta dig for it. You got to dig. Get in there to lick an asshole. It's not something that's just like, oh, a natural it's right act. There. It's an unnatural fucking. And that's why it's, it's a disgusting, it's dirty, filthy, de de degrading, deplorable act to just go underneath balls, hold the balls with your face, <laughs> and then l stick your tongue out. 
Oh, what's your, what's your ass looking action? Let's take a look. Is it dart in and out or is it licking? Oh, I thought we were watching it on set. Oh, no, we're stopping here. <laughs> <laughs> this is why, no, this why it, no one likes you. Um, if I did do it, I'd get shit on it. Dick well, in Detroit. If I do do it, so... Oh, here we go again. Dick? This bitch is, this bitch is an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> she's all like, I, I fucking hate men because they use logic. Yes, she's using logic to argue over on your fucking point. No, Doing whatever. Fake logic. Fake though. logic. I said it wasn't logic. logic. That's just how I felt. I never said it was logical. <sighs> Can you help me out with this ass liquor, Dick? Please. Is there anything know, you can help? It's, it's, she's she's incorrigible. This this really gay am. asshole liquor. All right, uh, uh, Bird in Chicago. Hey, uh, Leah, you are a non-profit. <laughs> I am a non-profit. Why not? You are a you <laughs> a, oh a charity asshole. You're a, <laughs> that. you're a you're a you're a you're a PBS whore. <laughs> <laughs> that, I'm, I am cool with that. Yes, you that is exactly. This awesome. should be this should be ten guys on the phone answering calls for Leah the Inca <laughs> asshole. Yes, hi. Yes, uh -huh. PBS. Yes, PBS asshole. I, yeah, I do it for the betterment of the community for mm -mm -mm. free. For free. No, I no, absolutely me, like this non for profit hey, asshole. Look, Leah, let me tell you why you're an asshole and you don't even understand why. <laughs> this shit all started back in '93 when Mary J. Blige and all those other goofy bitches was talking all that real love and wanted to be independent women, and nobody actually gave them direction on how to be independent. Direction. You can't be independent unless you have balls and a dick because we've been doing it since it's been done. So what you need to do is grab... Hey, hey here's her face. Hey, yo, her face is... This is why they never learn. See, what mm, we do is sense. we adjust to figure yeah. out how to conquer what we want. She has this face where, like, Thanks, one eye is blinking fast and the other eye is open. <laughs> yeah, but it's and she has this because there she are a has lot of this, very independent women. She has this looking in the air oh. like what you're saying is bullshit. But see, here's no, what women don't know one, how to do. She, they don't understand context. She's not feeling you. She only feels right. herself. Well, she what? only I feels herself. I change my mind on a lot of things, so that's, that's not true. Hey, that's the same problem I have with my bitch, man. We're going through counseling <laughs> well, right good. now. I'm glad that I'm... she doesn't understand that I'm right. And wrong. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> that's true. Absolutely. That'll, that'll send you to counseling. <laughs> A bitch not knowing you're right. <laughs> a bitch not knowing you're right will drive you crazy. Let her, let her. <laughs> I get the wrong picture, though. The reason why I'm right is just like Patrice and everybody else on the show is that because we listen, we take things into consideration, and we say, hey, you know what? That yeah, might, you might wrong. have something there. I might be wrong. You know yeah, what yeah. I mean? I'm not know, wrong that I should that. take sex for my money for sex. It's you, not wrong. You, you, you're just saying it, though. We actually, we actually weigh it out. Thanks for calling, man. We actually yeah, weigh it out in our whole mind. And we go. We actually come out to be proven wrong. When me and Dante are kicking on the phone, I actually want to be wrong when yeah. I say something. Because it, it, it escalates our thinking it's if like, I'm make wrong. Me wrong. Make it, me wrong, dude. Please help me out. Help me be wrong. You don't want to be helped to be wrong. Because you get a whole world. And here's why you do. You just what you do is you marginalize <laughs> men who I take know, the time who take the time to come up, call in. And say you are an asshole, and they're not saying it because I said so. They're just saying it because they now they have the they feel an they emotional have the feeling and they, they have can, something they can something put the attach feeling to. attached to that word, which is you're an asshole, which is what they want to call their girl. They want to call their wife that. Sometimes they want to call their mother that. Sometimes when you when it's like you you're just being a fucking dick right now. And you're being a dick, Leah. You're not being a reasonable and cooperative. You're just going, I don't like it. <clears throat> no, I'm no, an I asshole. And I fucked, I fucked, I fucked I two girls in college, but I'm no, not I'm going there. No, I'm being reasonable and cooperative. I'm not I going just, there. I'm not changing my mind, but I am being reasonable you, and cooperative. Okay, being, being reasonable, but you're not changing your mind. You're, you're not even taking it in. You're not even taking it in. You're not even taking it in with the possibility. No, I understand that what you're saying is that I don't have that across the board. Does that make sense to you, Drew? That someone, like, what if Drew said he licks ass because he loves if I look at look it and how's that you boil it down yeah. <clears throat> if if a chick if I'm looking at a chick's pussy and she goes nigga here's five hundred dollars <laughs> I'll be like what are you serious she'll be like yo I just got it please I said first of all the man in me will go come on bitch what are you take this money but then she goes I, 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 listen I've never had this, I've never had my pussy looking like please this please take just, this buy yourself I ain't got time I don't know what you like I don't want to go out there and buy you a, a, a get well soon card like that says thank you for eating my pussy uh, thank you goodbye fact, Here, I want you to take $500 and buy you something that you need if you don't need nothing nigga just go to a restaurant where the plate costs $500 do something for yourself cause man you made me you. feel good 
I'd be like, all right, bitch, cool. And if I take the money and she comes back and tries to go, now here's what the, the position I'm in. If she goes, I gave you $500, I'll go, bitch, here's 600 shut your face. Whereas I would go, bitch, you shouldn't have gave me $500. So here's, here's what it is. <laughs> she doesn't have the money to buy back her own dignity if she loses it. That's a good point. She's too broke to have dignity. She has, she has, she's too broke. I mean, I, you know what? I don't have a she, problem with, with she, a fact. She can't. If a guy gives her 12 five for sucking dick or licking asshole, she can't. She can't buy back her dignity that he that she and thinks And she's not he mentally strong to, enough to go fuck you. I got the five hundred dollars. I got the twelve five. Fuck you. I did it. Fuck you. And you're not going to change. So I now am. what we figured out now is what you said is that Leah is a weak minded, emotional, ass licking homosexual. <laughs> OK, cool. That's what the... you just said made no sense. But that's fine. Oh, fair enough. Did you understand it? Yeah. I understand oh, okay. what you're yeah. saying. Oh, you did understand, but it made no sense. All right. Back but to being an asshole. It, <laughs> it doesn't make it true. Um, it doesn't say it. Go to Ryan in Georgia. Let me see what he's talking about. All right, bro. I'm sitting here with my chick and we're listening to your show. <laughs> and we're talking about ass licking. <laughs> my, my chick's never licked my ass. And I'm like, all right, would you rather lick a chick's ass or my ass? Chicks are clean. And she's like, I'd rather lick a chick's ass. You know what? What the fuck that do with this bitch? You know what? She might be uh, in the chick's threesome. Ass, chick's ass all kind of cleaner, but it's weird. It's so weird, though, because... Here's why licking a man's ass is so weird to do, and how licking a woman's ass is, is such an easy thing to do. Is men's asshole is really far from deep. the next apparatus. <laughs> it's it's taint, and sometimes taint can be an inch long. Yeah. Then your 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 scrotum. So how your scrotum hangs is how far your asshole is from the next sexual apparatus. <laughs> so <laughs> women, have you ever stuck your finger in a woman's asshole and the thumb in the pussy? Yes. And there's like it's no room. It's, it's weird. It's, paper. It's, it's almost like aluminum foil it's separates like, uh, yeah. the like asshole saran from wrap. the pussy. It's like some you can almost <laughs> poke through it. It's, <laughs> it's like rice paper. It's just a weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's a weird thing. But it's so close yeah. that I think God made a woman's asshole cleaner because of all the kind of infections that a woman can get. Because asshole's so dirty yeah. and it's so close. I mean, the woman's tank can't be, but it almost you have to be metric system, like a, a centimeter, millimeters, a millimeter from the <laughs> pussy. So it's got to be. I would say licking a woman's asshole in general is a cleaner thing to do because I think men are. I mean, women hygiene is big with men now, though, but. I think hygiene is big in general, but yeah. I think women's have to have a certain, like they have to because wipe themselves a, right. a, a certain way or they can get an infection. You got to wipe back. like front to back, right from from pussy to the asshole, not from asshole to pussy, right. basically. Front to back. Yeah, you can't do it from asshole to pussy because that's taking. So you take asshole. And, but men don't give a fuck. I, you know, I wipe my ass like both you know. ways, <laughs> <laughs> vertical. I wipe my ass horizontal. <laughs> <with the, laughs> I start with the, from my head with, with the shower curtain, <laughs> nigga. Fuck it. I'm getting in there anyway. I always shit when I get ready to take a shower anyway, because I'm like, I don't feel like wiping. Let me just, I just he spray wipe, it clean with my wipe, fucking. You wipe from the right hip to the left hip <laughs> across I, the ass. I shake like a wet dog, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> shit on all the back, back of his balls and shit. <laughs> Oh, Horrible. Shit. I would say, dude. I would say, she's. Did you say your girl never had an asshole lick? She doesn't. She's oh, never he cut licked. off. Oh, that's too. She's never licked. Uh, all right, we're gonna take one more break before we finish up, man. We coming back right in, in about. I don't know. Whatever, Danny. How long are we coming back? Four minutes. All right, nigga. Four minutes. We'll be back. On the Black Phillips Show, Patrice O'Neal gets to the bottom of those tough relationship issues. Who had the herpes? It's Black Phillip with Patrice O'Neal. I want you to make a song dedicated to two girls, one cup <laughs> with this music. <laughs> Got she, it. She came up. She stuck her fist down her throat what? and then she went. <laughs> and the other girl shit. And we went. Uh, have you seen them? <laughs> <laughs> she had a tattoo and she pulled her ass open. And some moose came out and everybody went. Oh. 
<laughs> oh shit! I can't, I can't watch this no more. Have you seen her? Tomorrow is their future. How are you doing, um, lesbian ass licking? And what was the last thing we added to her? A non-profit uh, ass licking. A non-profit, a non a non-profit, a PBS ass licking. PBS homosexual we have here. I'm PBS. totally fine with that label. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's true. So what else, Dikey McAss Lick? <laughs> <laughs> it was since she's on PBS. Um, any PBS? Um, any PBS shows? Just, what What's going on? Um, Big Turd <laughs> from Sesame Street. <laughs> Big, Big Turd. <laughs> Uh, what's going on there? Uh, <laughs> who's that guy? Uh, Oscar. Oscar the Sploosh. How about Ernie, Ernie and Squirt? <laughs> Squirt and Ernie. <laughs> <laughs> what's going on there? What's, what's up with PBS shit? What's Kermit going? the Log. Kermit the Log? <laughs> oh what's up there, Kermit the Log? What's up? <laughs> It's not easy licking ass. <laughs> it's the color of brown it's and the not ground too... and the shit into chicks and a car. Wait a minute, electric company? Shit. <laughs> Wait. You guys are missing the obvious. It. Shit. <laughs> big, big turd. <laughs> big turd. That's what I said. Oh, I didn't hear I it. said oh, big fuck. turd, you bastard. Yeah. Come. It. Shit. <laughs> Le. Kick. Lick. <laughs> those, those little aliens that will go yip, 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 I licked 12 <laughs> assholes. Ah, 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 ah. How many assholes? Two. Two. Two, two assholes in college. <laughs> <laughs> Kermit the log is dating Miss Shitty. <laughs> Miss Shitty. Hi, Kirby. I'm going to lick your ass. Ten. Ten, ten ass licks. Ten assholes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. How many last? How many assholes you look at your life, Leah? One. One. She's lying. I'm gonna say eleven. Eleven. <laughs> eleven. Eleven assholes. assholes. How many assholes have you like? Uh, 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 uh. Huh? How many assholes have you like? Shit, unnamed. Don't ask. Don't me. Don't even know, nigga. I've been around the world sticking my tongue in bad places. <laughs> <laughs> I think I licked an ass in Vietnam and a fucking leech came up on my shit. <laughs> Seriously, them two girls on the video from Brazil could have been two girls he was fucking no, with. I, 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 I know them. I just didn't want to call them out. That's, they, that's Barbara and, um, and <laughs> Samantha. <laughs> <laughs> them bitches wouldn't even let me shit in the cup with them. <laughs> they was holding out on you. <laughs> Black dildos wasn't enough for them. Oh, shit. Oh, what do you got here? Mm. Oh, you know what, though? Danny, we forgot to talk about this. Stop the presses. Danny got rid of that stinky veterinarian he was oh, with. fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Last yeah. time he was here, last time on that, as uh, Patrice, uh, as the fucking Black Phillips show turned, <laughs> Danny was talking about how he had this smelly veterinarian with a funky kitten smell and all over it. Smell like a cat box. Sweatpants. And, and fucking, fucking puppy medicine. Crocs. And she wouldn't be nice to him. And he fucking dumped her. And he dumped her for a fucking little hottie, might oh, I say. Cutie. That's right. Come here, sweetie. Let's take a look at this fucking deliciousness that Danny got Good rid job, of that Danny. mess for. Good job. <laughs> Absolutely. You should have seen this. You look so much I happier. Mean, oh, my God. How old are you, beautiful? Oh, look at her. Delicious. Look at her. You know the worst part about it? She his, looks Chris Hansen like. Danny said his ex-girlfriend wouldn't like put on makeup, wouldn't fix herself up, but you know she's doing that now for some new guy. <laughs> um, yeah, but so what? But also, don't matter now. eventually she's what will fraud. happen is that she'll end up coming home smelling like um, Shit, salamander. And, her. and she'll get dumped And she'll again. tell him stories like, I couldn't save the owl. You know what she likes to go dress up for? She, she likes to, to get all gussied up to go out uh, to, to some shit dive bar with her sister. And, that's and what not she, dress up for you. Yeah, and not fucking infuriated me. And look at this tender Ooh, little delicious. Tender, oh my cutie. god. Oh Good my job, god. Daddy. Look at her. She Good plucked job. her eyebrows and drew them back in. <laughs> just a little white trash, but she's so she's just sexy. Sitting here hanging out. Perky. With what are you? Just what are you? Five smiling. four. Five four one twenty. Wow. <laughs> Five one, not even a hundred pounds. Five nine, mm, that's good, five, Danny. Five one. You know I have a theory, Danny, about five one ninety eight pounds. Pitch. Danny, you're fucking a baby. 
Yeah. <laughs> There's a, I seen a fat baby on Maury Povich that was bigger was, than her. Was 98 pounds. <laughs> a 27 year old baby. Awesome. Oh my God. And Danny's a sex life much better. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's uh. Like how far? On what level? <laughs> like what's better about it? Not on on that, all, that, not uh, on our level though. Yeah, not you, a, you, you have to get in your, detail, but, but how was it? How 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 is it good? Is she a soldier? Yeah, of course. Yes, sir. Like lick my balls, yes, sir. <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, we yeah. haven't gotten to the lick my balls part. Why, why not, beautiful? <laughs> have you done? But y'all have had sex, right? Of course, yeah. So why not licking balls? That's something only special love people get. I don't know. You don't even. It has know. A, at least she's not like you. Come on. I mean, I don't know. At least she's like, honest, I don't even girl. have a good reason. She's I just like, didn't lick them balls. Is it because he doesn't shave? Danny seems like he got his balls he's look like. No, I've. Uh, well, I mean, I, like I have in the past. He's I have shaved balls. Five. Five. <laughs> <laughs> Danny's got chia balls. I thought everybody says it about me. You look like a hairy Danny. You just look like there's something wrong with your balls, Danny. You look like your balls have a goatee. Your balls look like they have a mustache, a full beard, and a goatee. Daddy, your balls. They, I, they, it, how, does he shave his balls, gorgeous? No. It's their mess. Shave your. You want me to shave him? I shave No, him. don't ask her, you fucking <laughs> idiot. Just do it and say ah. Do you, voila. Did you hear what my threesome story about my balls? Why I added that? It when you have clean balls, girls you grab. Want they want to suck clean I know, no. balls. Dude, I know. It's pretty because it's we smooth. make them shave their pussy all the time, man. That's the least you can fucking do. Is shave your balls. I know. It's, it, you know what it is. I, I've, I, I've done it in the past. It's just I don't. I don't. I hate dealing with the whole maintenance of it. And then you it can't say itch, that, dude. It's just yeah. See, see, up, you, you, you yeah, step up your you game, like man. your veteran. Beautiful. Hag. Would you? Would you? Let me ask you this. Would you like your balls lick, Dan? Dancer? Of course. All right, beautiful. If he shaves his ball and don't <laughs> listen, don't rush shave either, you fucking animal. Take you look time. like the type of nigga that have toilet paper picks. All his balls. This is like an owl owl on his balls. Sweetie, I cut my balls. <laughs> Just just slowly take a whatever you need to do. Take one of them white boy razors like the the Naroko movement and shave <laughs> Mach, Mach your Mach 3 ball. Turbo. Mach 3 Turbo. <laughs> the new moving head and shave your rotten balls. And you know what else you shave? Your ass. Shave your ass. You got to put like a bitch. Now, this is a tough one. This is almost like sitting down peeing. Yeah. You got to put your leg up on the sink. And shave it out. And shave that ass. Nah. What is that? What is that? Who oh, knows? No. Who cares? I don't know. Long Wait, not a bomb. Who is that? Listen, that's her. From the from the big party last night. Well, uh, you guys missed it. Oh, what party? I didn't get invited. Uh, it was the baby fuck party. Baby fuck? <laughs> well, her name is uh, her nickname is Baby Girl, and there's another girl that's and her nickname is Angel Fuck. Look so you put them thing. together and it's Baby Fuck. Oh my goodness! I know she shaves. <laughs> yeah, of course. Oh, it's probably nice. impeccable. It's nice. And skinny girls got. Fat coochie lips, man. Perhaps. Oh my goodness. <laughs> nice. She's squatting down. She's squatting on your face before. Of course. Of course. So, she, so you've done the dirty deed to her, and she didn't do it to you. And she seems like she's a, a good girl. She's saying, really, I, well, I got you, sweet. I got you. She's saying desperately, she wants to take action down there. <laughs> and you, you know what well, you are? It'll you're be, just a. It'll be taken. You're, you're just a 15 hour a day stand up, tired. Radio guy who just doesn't have time to shave his balls. I'd much rather nap than shave my balls. <laughs> you know what you do when you get, get home the, tonight? Depilatory. When you get home tonight, just put that right leg up and take care of that, and she'll hook you up. Is that true, sweetness? Sure. Soldier. See? Fucking soldier. Absolutely. Oh, my I'll do it when I get home. Huh? I'll do it when I get home. Good job. For real. Yeah. I'm for real. I'll be shaving my balls in 40 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, because she, she just wants, I'm telling you, and the thing is, when you shave your balls, like, when when I when my balls is out of control, and I got gray hair in my shit now, too. <laughs> oh, wow. And you know gray hair is coarse, so yeah. it'll just be hair, but then it'll be one gray hair that I, I think is dust, and when I hit it, <laughs> I roll it, up. it goes down it. and it flips right back up. <laughs> and you ever pull a gray hair out? It hurts because the roots are dead, so it's like it just... Oh, it's a dead hair the ball. in your balls. You just ah, and all your ball skin comes up with it. <laughs> you can lift your whole ball up with one hair. Awesome. That stubborn gray one. And so, it, 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 you when I my when my balls ain't right, I don't know what that is. I don't know. It's somebody's phone. Whatever, man. 
when when your ball when your ball hair ain't right, what happens is you don't want nobody down there. So if your girl goes to lick, you're gonna go, nah, it's oh, it's cool, come on back, because you're not. You don't feel at your, at your top freshness. You know what I'm saying? If you shave that shit clean, dude, you be all right. I have in the past. But shave it now, man. You got to look at her. Do you know, I met your old girlfriend, and I hate to talk about it like this, but she's gone. <laughs> it's okay. I didn't like it that much, because I, I thought that her energy was, was down. I thought I thought it was, you, you both of y'all made me sick together. I spoke, I actually, I had spoken to her about that, because, you know, because it had been brought up on this show. So I brought it up to her, and her excuse for being in such a, a foul mood that day was that somebody had to drive home. This was at the virus tour, where Patrice met her. And uh, she was all pissed off because someone had to drive, and I was the one uh, that was be able to drink, and she couldn't drink. So and she that's was why all, she brought she was time, your That's why she brought your day down. Yeah, because she couldn't drink. And I'm trying to be like, look, I just fucking, you know, it, it's, a, it's a huge concert thing. You know, you didn't go to any of the ones last year, you know. I'm just trying to swing my dick around for two minutes, bringing you backstage. Oh, look at all the comics and everything. And she couldn't even just a fucking <laughs> appreciate. Up, let's go to Steve real quick. He's a fucking. <laughs> hey, Steve. Hey, hey, I, sh- I fucking, I shaved my balls. I took out my Mach three and shaved my balls. <laughs> so my wife would fucking suck them. And she's like, I'd rather suck your fucking hairy balls than your stubbly balls. Why? Why did she say yeah. that? It's just what, what she likes. Her tongue. What the fuck? It's just what she wants. She just wants hair in her mouth. Wow. Why don't she just lick your head? <laughs> she needs to lick no, your underarm. I'm doing it wrong. My, my fucking, you know, I shaved them. Stubble nah, I think, a Mark, you know? I think a Mach 3 gets it all yeah, off. You <laughs> You're a soldier. You shave with a Mach 3. That's ugly. I mean, seriously. Do you shave your um, vagina hair, Leah? Can't divulge that information? No, that's fine. Sometimes I wax. Some, depends on the season. Really? Yeah, like summer's a full wax, winter's like kind of just a little bit. I bet you a coochie looks like a scaled bass. <laughs> no. <laughs> it, <laughs> no, it definitely does not. <laughs> Look at Leah. She's so mad. I'm not I, mad I, I love Leah. Leah. I love Leah. Uh, any day. And I agree with his wife that uh, like a nice trim is nicer than shaved balls. Oh, spoken like a true homosexual. You. I'm talking about balls. If, is it gay? Ken says, is it gay if if a girl puts a dildo on his ass? Wait, you don't have to go to him. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> David, David, quickly. D- yes, Ken, you're a fag. David, quickly, tell us why you have Leah figured out. Okay. It's called uh, socially acceptable rebellion. Remember when she said she, yes, did sleep with women, but she immediately had to qualify it with I was in college? Yes. Mm. Oh, That's why. he just explained That's your, why. your infinite phoniness. This is, ladies and gentlemen, our friend David in Texas is, is I've never actually heard about it. Sounds scientific. He could have made it up, but so what? Science, nice science, 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 scientists term. make I, shit up. Actually, I, I did just make it up. At, you know what? Good. And Smart now guy. it's official. Socially acceptable rebellion is a new word. Yo, and you know yo. what that stands for? Our language, she's a phony bitch. Exactly. Socially acceptable rebellion. rebellion. You phony bitch. Thank you for calling, Dave. Hey, is You're that welcome. it? Yeah. That's a shame. That went by. We needed a six-hour return. Seriously. <sighs> but anyway, listen. We thank y'all for showing up. We're gonna be here what next month or something. We try to get that weekly thing going, but yeah, we'll it's, figure it's, it out. You know how this whole thing is. But anyway, <clears throat> appreciate it, Drew. The lovely Leah Bonima and you. Yeah. Uh, Dante. Yeah, Drew, yeah. Do, uh, anything to plug, Drew? No, sir. Anything to plug, Leah? No, no, no yeah, kids? Uh, yeah, no. I'm Leah's going to be working Broadway. free where? Uh, when I'm licking balls, I work for free. <laughs> <laughs> Leah's going to be licking asshole and doing comedy and, uh, where at? When I, when Come I on, baby. Children, I work for, oh, at, on Censored Show at Broadway. Midnight, where, where Friday at? and Saturday. Friday, Saturday. Oh, at Broadway Comedy Club, yeah. right? Leah's going to be, Leah Bonima, along with um, her lovely husband or lovely fiance now. Fiance. Dustin Schaefer over at uh, Broadway Comedy Club. Where's that? Quick, quick. 53rd between 8th and 9th. 53rd between 8th and 9th Avenue at the Broadway Comedy Club. You'll see the lovely Leah. And she is lovely, by the way. Yep. In like a, you know. A mistress. In a, in a, a mistress. Side, side, side bitch kind of <laughs> sneak out my girls coming right away uh, fucking thing. You got anything? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to be at Stand Up New York the weekend of the 20th. Stand Up New York is. Third, uh, 70 oh, what's the number at this, at this place? You don't know the number? Anyway, uh, Stand, Stand New York. York 21st, 23rd. Don't forget uh, the Patrice O'Neill show coming yeah, soon. Patrice, the podcast. Yeah, the podcast. Gotta watch Patrice O'Neill coming soon. Uh, 212-595-0850 is the uh, yeah. is Stand Up New York. And uh, anything? That's it? Well, listen. Uh, I think, well, Patrice is going to be at uh, Stand Up New York for New Year's New Eve. Year's? Yeah. Uh, yeah, but oh. yes, I'm going to actually be at uh, Comics on December 28th and 29th. 
That's Friday, that. December 28th, and Saturday, December 29th at <laughs> Comics uh, in New York, nigga. All right, we'll see y'all next.